Let's go ahead and pull the curtains back and get things on the go. Um, Matt, or should I say, um, <coughs> Fiffany, you mm -hmm. still have three spirit guardians up. I do. Um, lighting the way. Um, let's see. Uh, yep, affected. So when you cast a spell, you can designate any number of creatures you can see to be unaffected by it. An affected creature speed is halved in the area and when the creatures enter the area for the first time on a turn, uh, starting its turn there. So um, it must make a wisdom saving throw. Okay. So technically, as this thing dived out, it entered your thingy. So um, it's going to have to make its wisdom save before okay. anything else happens. Um, so let's go ahead and pull back the maps. Cue up some sound effects. Blah. Uh, that'll work. Okay, um, so wisdom save. What is the DC of your wisdom? Saves? 17. Ooh, okay. Um, spiders ain't fucking wise. No, they're not either. It's not a, <laughs> doesn't bode well for our spider friend. Uh, well, that's how the old adage goes. Straight spiders have lots of eyes, but aren't very wise. Uh, no, failed miserably, sir. Okay, um, so what does that mean? Um... Do you want me to re repop it so, here? Uh, on a failed save, it takes 3d8 oh, yeah, okay. radiant damage. Um, it is not evil, so it just takes the 3d8 radiant damage. Um, but also... Um, let's see. And yeah, so every turn that it stays in that area... It will potentially take that. All right, so give us the initial 3d8 radiant damage for the 3d8. Sector. Come on up, baby! Yikes! Not a bad start. That's a pretty bad start. Of damage <laughs> for the way. big bad sifter. Pretty bad start. All righty. <laughs> um, you know what we need now? Initiative wow. oh. for everybody. So uh, let me go ahead and uh, one second. Oh. Sorry. Really? <laughs> there we go. Okay. <laughs> whoop, whoop. Damn. Ooh. Okay. All right, not, so. Not the best, guys. Last of Curse yeah. is on an 11. <laughs> not the best. Um, Lyra is on a 16, because she gets that special thingy where she gets to do two rolls. Um, then we have Fiffany on a 12. And. Benefer on a Finger. three. Okay. Um, our Sipter. Let's go ahead and roll his. And he will be going... Ooh. Worse. Whatever, dude. <laughs> <laughs> hey, at least it was an initiative roll. <laughs> yes, that's very true. And that is a little mandible yeah. bite. No. Okay. Um, all right. Um, so... Uh, at the start of the initiative, technically is the start of its turn. Uh, it makes another save. Doesn't look good for the spider. <laughs> dumbass, dumbass spider. Nope. Yes. Uh, give it another 3d8, Ooh. why don't you? Ooh, I will. This one's going to be better, too. Watch this. It's going to be an 8, a 5, and a 5. Is it? 8, a 6, and a 4. Oh, <laughs> Guys. Nice. I mean, oh, that was pretty Alrighty, good. a whole bunch of radiant he damage the for the spider. I need the total. How it got there is, you know, <laughs> irrelevant. Let's see, what can we do for you? Um, here we go, and poof. There's some radiant damage. Ooh, look at look how radiant it is. Ooh, oh, radiant it's a sparkly spider. Yeah, oh, that's a beautiful no. spider, Christy. It's an, oh, it's a vampire spider now. I hate it. Uh, okay, uh, it is the sifter's turn to attack. Um, mm. Mm, choices, choices. Um, it has the choice of a Fiffany, or it has the choice of a Lyra. It looks more delicious, you know. Lyra's less like crunchy. Lyra? Yeah, which one looks like more like a weevil. Let's yeah. decide randomly. One, two, Lyra. 
Oh, I'm sorry, Larry. I was really hoping it was me. <laughs> yeah, you were. <laughs> okay. I was. I can take it. Yeah, that's nice. Well, you know. All righty. The spider lunges forward with its two huge fangs raised in an attempt to bite you. I picture it. I wish I had. A 13. I don't think Mess. that's going to hit Lyra. All right, you are definitely quick enough to avoid the two fangs slipping off to the side before it manages to impale you with its venom-dripping teeth. Um, it is now your turn to retaliate. All right, I'm going to stay in it in melee, I guess, but I'm going to move just move over here um, to give some room to the others. Okay. Um. I'm also. Uh, yeah, you can do that because you're not leaving. As long as you don't leave the thingy. I'm also going to bonus action. Bonus. Um, well, where bonus is it? action. Hunter's mark. Here it is. Okay. I'll post it. Yep. Just to mark the creature. Okay. Um, uh, which gives you an extra. Um, basically, gives you a little bit of extra damage, an extra one d six whenever you hit it. Yeah. And will you remind me in 5e, does it matter using a ranged weapon in close proximity? Is that disadvantage? Just wondering. Um, I don't remember. I do not believe so. <laughs> it doesn't matter? That's weird. Okay. Then I'll attack with my bow twice. Let me have a quick look here. Okay. I'm gonna look at something. Now you say that. Um, I'll just do my extra damage for Hunter's Mark. If you hit. Oh, true, I don't know yet. Oh, wait. One, one of them probably did, but I don't know about the other one. Mm -hmm. That's a better question. Hold on a second. Because there is... You know. Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. Do you have the point-blank shot feet? I believe so. Ooh, uh, good question. That's Let me look for my feet. I'm going to... Probably not. Ooh. I don't think I have any feet. Trying to get rid of this, I got something blocking the dam. Oh, because she's point blank with a ranged weapon. Uh, yeah, so you gain advantage on a ranged attack with, made within 30 feet. Um, ranged attacks made against adjacent targets have neither advantage or disadvantage. Um, but without that, I believe you are at disadvantage to shoot if you are at melee range. Okay, um, let then me... consider those two. My let, first yeah, hold one, on. I guess. Let me let me verify that. If you hadn't have asked me, think, I would have probably just answered it. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I think technically it is, it is that technically, but I don't know. I think it is, isn't it? But I I think I just assumed that Lyra probably had it, but you don't. So because um, of the fact, the point blank feet exists, right? <laughs> right. Um. So, I mean, uh, now that I know that, I'll probably use a different weapon in melee. Yeah, yeah. Um, one hand, is, one hand, my long sword. Yep, there switch. you go, that's right. Okay. okay. Alright, I'll be attacking with my long sword, just one-handed. Yeah, she's not high two. enough. Like <gasps> well, look at that damage, though. Of course. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Waste. <laughs> Wow. Natural Jeez. 20! I bet I was. There we go. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> uh, oh, got dear. my 20, though. Didn't disappoint. No. Nope. Lyra Brigade. Okay, there you go. There's your 20. Okay, um. So you did. 
eight damage <laughs> with a crit and Hunter's Mark. That's so sad. Yeah, I know. Wow. Oh. Uh, but at least you got your 20. <laughs> Can we really strike? We need to strike that 20 from the record. That, that's not <laughs> I agree. That's a... That's the hey, weakest go, a, go ahead, I'll just get it. Hey, again. if we have to strike every 20 because the damage wasn't very good, then Matt would have zero. <laughs> so, what? How mean? Damage is always low. My natural uh, 20 investigating. Hey, well, my, yeah, now I'm talking about other characters. Normally. Got that, to the top. That Bar 20 I attacking. I killed a fucking dragon? What did I kill? I killed a dragon. Did I? I don't oh, remember. I did wyvern. something cool. <laughs> it might have been. The, it was the wyvern. The, oh, I think you. No, did. Well, I think dragon. I ran away. No, it, I ran away from that fight. So That's right. You did. You did. For a good reason. Mm. All I For know good is. Reason. All I know is that twenty I got investigating a fire pit was more useful than. <laughs> <laughs> well, this could this could kill it. I I have hit no it twice. Shame. It's true. Is I it dead, Gore? Square. That's a fair uh, is it dead? No, it is not dead. As far as I'm concerned. Even though I got to roll four times just now. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, well. Because I messed up. I wouldn't be upset if you invalidated it. So, you yeah, know. I think. I think <laughs> no, you'd be I'm not. I'm not. The, the <laughs> act of rolling the 20, you were successful in. Um, Thank you. You hit thank, real, thank you, you hit exactly where you aimed. It was just the fact thank that you were you. aiming at one of its thank leg you. hairs that was the yeah, problem. Thank you. So, you know. Um, all right, Lasticus. Uh, all yeah, the way back I, there. I'm going to firebolt it. Just a simple Ooh, little what? cantripy. What was that? <laughs> Shocking it. Ooh, that's a good one. <laughs> Yeah. He's a robot, so he's got all the sound waves. That's all the sound waves. <laughs> uh, got the same sound okay, 15 points of fire, fire damage. Pew, pew. That's exactly what it sounds like, huh? <laughs> Tiffany! Yeah, I'm just going to um, kind of position myself a little closer to the spiders, make myself as big as possible. Okay. Uh, just to kind of kind of get um, it. The spider is now... Um, threatened so you would actually have flanking bonus oh uh does that count uh, for cantrips as well um if it is an attack uh if there's an attack uh, roll I, I, I involved see, i see i see i see if there's an attack yes. roll involved you get plus two because of flanking okay yeah so you know what seeing um the spider that right? hang on or am this... i thinking god yeah I... that would change hang on that would definitely change what i do I'm putting Gore through it today. Well, no, it's just I, I bounce between because I bounce between five E and three point five, and my brain is somewhat kind of fried right now. Um, <laughs> let's see. Um, yeah, it's a fire pit. <laughs> <laughs> No, uh, ignore what I just said. That's wrong. Wrong addition. <laughs> Plus you know two what? flanking is three point five, um, and I completely yeah. Um, we played the last campaign with three point five, um, so ignore that. Okay. <laughs> so okay. So I'm going to. Uh, yeah, there are no plus right? twos in five e. There are no pluses. Right. So I'm going to cast guiding bolt then. In that case. Good deal. Okay. Do it. Yeah, and just kind of and and shoot forward at him. Come on. All righty. Um, nice best. damage. Not bad, not bad. 18 is definitely a hit. Flash of light streaks Ooh. forward. Creature of a choice within rage makes a ranged spell attack against the target on a hit, which it did. Takes 46 radiant damage. Um, and the next attack roll made against this target before the end of your next turn has a disadvantage. That was the bit I was right. going to read. Because um, it's more than just a buzzing spell. <laughs> yes. Okay, I'll mark my spell slot for that. Okay. Advantage, nice. <clears throat> yeah. Um, so, um, blowing. Okay, so that one more yep. spell. One um, more so, spell every, basically, that means, Fennifer, you're up and you have advantage. Mm-hmm. Ooh, goody. Courtesy okay. of your sister of the light, Fiffany. Yeah. 
That's what I do. I bring light to anyone, even if they don't want it. <laughs> I love, I love the light. What are you talking about? I'm gonna not, no, not for you, for the spoon. Let me just scoot right past you here. I'm going to oh, yeah. go ahead and give him a good smack. Yes. Does it get extra penalties because of extra eyes? No. <laughs> oh, that's a good... <laughs> Advantage, disadvantage. That's all there is. <laughs> it doesn't advantage. get extra, extra, extra Octuple advantage. Octuple disadvantage. Yeah. Right. Yep, you hit nice. it either way for 13. Yes. And then, uh, shag it correct me. You have two attacks. I have two attacks, but then, so when I do have a hit because I have improved Divine Smite, does that extra D8 damage get automatically applied? Or oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's the a extra part of the D8 matter. is on that damage. It's on roll. that. Okay, just making sure. Uh, the question is do you that. wish to choose Ooh. to load anything on top of it? I'm not at the moment, okay. but I just was curious to make sure that one was still Alrighty. coming in. Okay, I'm going to attack again. Second attack. Just just a normal attack this time, right? Because no, advantage. advantage. Both nope, get advantage? still has advantage. Um, I think. There we go. It's just one, I think. Oh, it is? Oh, no, it is only oh. one. It's the it, yeah, the next the next attack roll. That's what I thought. Oh, uh, okay. okay. Well, um, my first one was still an 18, so was that count? So it would have been the first oh, one. It would have been, 18, it so been the, we'll the first one. Yeah. Nice. Um, by default. Perfect. So, uh, yes, you hit it for 13. Yay. Nice. All right. And it goes back to the top of the tree. And our spider has to make a save throw. Yes, he does. 17. And he's going to take another 3d8 radiant damage. 3d8. Boo! Yikes. <laughs> <laughs> damage. Okay. Hey. Um, Not bad. Well, Been now there. I don't think. All right. What it's going to do um, is it's going to use a um, healing potion. <laughs> no. Those two little legs and be like. Oh, 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 oh. All right. Little, it's, little okay. So it's a spider, not a super intelligent creature. Um, so it is going to retreat to here yeah. so that it cannot be flat. Um, can't be got behind. Um, that being said, um, go behind the couch, and then we're not going to know where it is. It's the worst. Um, all three of you may make an attack of opportunity Ooh. if you wish. Absolutely, I do hey. wish. Jane, nice. deal more than two damage. Oh, uh, oh no! Ten from the mace of smiting. No, I can't. Oh, no. Oh, you got a D6, no. though, right? D6, right? Oh, oh, yes, I do. Give her the giant dagger back again. Give her the dagger back Extra D6 for your Hunter's Mark. Yes. You did it there. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, nice. <laughs> and then, uh, Gore, I have the Warcaster feat, so I am able to cast a cantrip or a spell if I want to as Ooh. a uh, attack of opportunity. Yeah. Um, so I'm just gonna, I'm just going to do a cantrip here. Okay. So I have to save some of my spells in case there's more of these things down here. So it's gonna be Toll uh, the Dead. Now. What, yes? No, um, you can do that, but that still does not negate the rule of, um, well, actually it won't matter because your turn Nope, you're good. It says, uh, yeah, it says I can cast any any spell of any kind as long as the cast time is one action. Right, yeah. That's cool. And this, and this, and this is, is only one action. You're good. Correct, um, correct. Okay, it makes so a saving throw. Yeah, DC saving 17 throw, should again. I say. Damn, that dice though, Matt. Yeah, I've not been rolling the best. And uh, it's still... It's, let's see here. Hold on. it's a lot of free damage. something real quick. Damage. Not a free damage. Okay. Yeah, you see Debo, yeah, you see Debo Samuel score a touchdown, Jane? No, I was looking. Yeah, maybe. Okay. Uh, you cast Guiding Bolt. For the first one, yes. Yeah, okay. This was Totally the Dead. Yeah, that's right. But it can it can save to not get hit for this one. Yep, one sec. And 
saving throw. It is going to... Oh, it passes. Ooh. That's fine. At least it's not on my spirit guardians. I'll take it. <laughs> I'll take that. Yep. Um, okay. Target must uh, succeed on a wisdom saving throw or take 1d8 necrotic guy if the target is... A... Yep, that's all it does because if it passes, it takes no yep, damage. Yep, it passes. Yep. So, okay. Cool beans. Um, that was his move. All right. Um, it is going for its action. All right. Um, it's going to basically go whoosh and hurl out webbing. And we're gonna. Oh, I hate that. Extend it. Yeah. To... <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't like this. No. It's nice. us? What? All right. Um. Okay. It's Probably basically whoosh, webs the area. Everybody, make a. Um, dexterity saving throw. Ooh, that's not going to be good for fifth and e. That's my favorite. <laughs> you sure it's not a string? Dex <laughs> save. Here we go. Uh, Boom. Yes. Uh, damn it. Damn, damn James. James. Did mine roll? <laughs> mine is being so laggy. Ooh. Why didn't it roll? Dex save. Try harder. I'm trying. You pressed Ooh. the button hard enough. Okay. Web does. That means we got the apartment. It means we got the apartment. Yeah. <laughs> Um, all right, so those two of you that failed, you are considered restrained currently. Cool. Uh, which means what? Well, a restrained creature's speed becomes zero, and it can't benefit from any bonuses to its speed. Attack rolls against the creature have advantage, and the creature's attack rolls have disadvantage. Um, so basically, that is um, where you're currently at. Um, Jane, you are unaffected. Uh, each creature that starts its turn in the web um, may, must make a dexterity saving throw. On a failed save, you can stay retrain, uh, restrained. Um, when you pass, of course, um, what you do is a creature restrained by the web can use its action to, to choose to make a strength check against the web. If it succeeds, you are no longer restrained, but you have to choose to do that as an action. So... Um, that is what it is doing. Lyra, you start your turn, but you are not affected by the web, so you can do what you want to do. Right. I mean, I have my long sword out. It's, when I look at the two covered in web, does it look like I could just easily help like slash through it for them? No. Oh. Then I ignore them and go, um, oh, I will defeat allow them. You, I will allow <laughs> you to make a strength check to try to free one of them. Nah, so worth it. <laughs> okay. I think I think I, I, at least Fifany would be like, "It's all right, go get him, baby, go get him." As I'm trying yeah. to break free my fell, I'd want yeah. her to, to keep keep yeah, the onslaught. Yeah, we got Go ahead. All right. Yeah. I, yeah, I go up to attack with my long sword. Yeah. Right. Oh, girl. Ooh, nice. Oh, that's yeah. Uh, that's nice. Yeah. You did it once, all right, you only missed out on two damage. It's fine. Uh, let me get my other damage and know if I other hit. Other d six for your hunter's mark. <laughs> Nice. Alrighty. Okay. Good deal. Um, this thing is definitely looking worse for wear, but it is still currently active. Um, Lasticus, uh, you can't actually see it from where you are because it's retreated into the hole. Uh, if I move up to behind, careful, baby. This guy, we got wits over here. Careful. Can I see through it? Kind um, of. Um, what do you want to cast? Uh, I want to cast Magic Missile. Uh, that I will say you can cast, because while you can't really get a clear line of sight, you can physically make it out, and Magic Missile doesn't require you to actually hit. It's just a guided ball yeah. of whoosh that goes around or... whatever it needs to, so Magic Missile is fine. Pew, pew, pew! Nine <laughs> points of Watch the hair, watch the hair. Okay. You just see little ball balls of light fly past you too. Alrighty. Um... Ah, wah, wah, wah. Tiffany, Jeez, you start out. your turn in the mm -hmm. web, so unless you've got a range attack or something like that, or whatever, um, or cast a spell, um, you can choose to make a strength check with your action to try to rip out of it. Strength check. Um, 
No, I, I mean, that's not really my strong suit. If I'm still able to cast, I probably would just keep casting. So Restrained, um, all Restrained does is basically um, any attack rolls you make are at disadvantage. You okay. Have disadvantage on deck saves and your movement is zero, but it doesn't stop you casting actual spells. Okay. Um, but if it's an attack gonna... spell, it's at disadvantage. Right. Okay. I'm gonna try to hit this thing with Toll the Dead again. So I missed last time. Okay. I'm just gonna kind of move my hands like like into the web like to cast my spell. <laughs> Wiggle my little fingers at it because I can't yes. really aim it. So it's it's uh, it kind of works a little bit better that way. Anyways. That's good damage. Righty. There um, we go. It will attempt Much its better. save. And it will fail. Okay. Uh, 1d8 points of necrotic damage. Um, it has taken damage. So um, that bumps it to a d12. Yep. And that was the d12 roll there. What level are you? 11th, right? Correct. Yeah, okay. That's right then. 3d8. Uh, yep. 4, well, 3d12. 20. Oh, 3d12, yeah. 3, yeah. 26, nice. Yeah, not bad. Um, That's exactly, exactly enough to finish it off. Um, with Toll of the Dead being the spell that you're casting, um, how do you want to, how does it die? Uh, it essentially, uh, the bells appear and start to to gong loudly around it and the resonance of the sound start to sh start to make it jitter since it's it's uh so weak at this point and you can start to see whatever sort of brain matter it has start to leak through every one of its little eye holes Ooh. as it slowly just sort of spasms and then melts down to the ground sounds fun right way to die <laughs> And Fiffany's gonna kind of give uh, like a full bodied restraint, like, woo! you know, but like while trying to struggle in the in the <laughs> way. <laughs> I'm gonna try not to throw up, but I'm also very excited. Woo! You see how that one went down? Oh, beautiful. Oh my, I've never seen anything like it. There you uh -huh. go. Good job. <laughs> no. No. Ew. Gross. <laughs> Oh, no, no, I, it up again. Yeah. I gotta say, I didn't know, I didn't know that, I didn't know that that was going to happen. Uh, <laughs> I, I really didn't, but, um, I mean. That's a messy one. Right. I mean, um, I mean, This hooray. is not a spell, it's a physical web, so you are both still restrained until you break out of it, but yeah. as, a, as you're not under any immediate threat, um, it's really just a case of time. Yeah, we'd be wiggling. We'll try. Um... Hey, um, last keys, you want to get one of those little pickaxe out here? Maybe make it like useful for once and c get us down from here. Uh, uh, oh, you, you, um, useful. <laughs> That's uh, funny. Uh, sure, sure. I'm going to take one of the pickaxes out and offer the hack at the webbing. <laughs> yeah, you're not finessing it around me. You're just kind of cutting chunks off. Yeah, so I have to like, pretty much just like, yeah. Watch armor, don't scrap. Pull it. <laughs> Baby, what do you think the thing's gonna do to our armor? Come on now. Just Don't make me laugh. Don't, Don't make me laugh. That's a good idea. Well, too late now. Add that real uh, quick. <laughs> do you know how long it's gonna take to get this off? I hate this place. This is not good. There's no light at all. It's no, scary. Well, yeah, it's not the best, but we'll be all right. Uh, we are oh, the light. We are yeah. the light. Ho hold up your hand. I'm, I'm gonna hack under your armpits. Oh, oh, that, oh yeah. be careful. I'm very good. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get me. <laughs> I don't think that would tickle, by the way, if it hit your armpit. Just saying. It's more. It's more mental, you see. Yeah. It's more I know mental, it's right? I can it, feel the vibration. Exactly. Oh, it's <laughs> right. It's like before you get hit, you go ow when you're a little kid, even though you haven't got hit yet. It's just sort of a mental thing. You know what I'm talking about? I still do that. Yes. Right. <laughs> see. So there you go. So you understand. As a little kid, we you understand. Really talk about that much, but it was pretty bad. <laughs> All righty. I'm gonna go into the little You're free. area. Okay, you, so you you climb over the squishy dead spider. Yeah, and um, explore it. Okay. A bit. Um, other than there being, you know, some um, kind of dead, very large dead insects, dead beetles, a couple of dead ants, and stuff like that, um, that have been pretty much like had all of the juices sucked from their carapaces. That's about all you find. Strangely enough, a spider, even a giant spider, doesn't really have any loot. 
So there's no like plus five mm. verbal sword? Like, no. It doesn't <laughs> drop like a satchel of gold or anything? <laughs> like a wolf bone or something that would not, not no, have on not it today. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. A goblin's the only, shoe. The only souvenir you could take is one of its fangs if you want it. I'm, what would I'm I do getting... with a spider's fang? Well, Show they... it off. Make a necklace. I, I do Lyra. it all the time. It's not my Lyra. style. Yes. When, when, you, when you grow back to full size, it'll be like that big. <laughs> <laughs> Look what I got. Trendy. Okay. Little okay. Are so trendy. Well, if we carve our name on it or do like a real uh, intricate thing, then we can show it off later. People be like, how'd you do that so yeah, intricate? Like like rice right, exactly. They, they were, there there yes. is the um the, the, the sacks, the poison sacks. You can coat your weapon. Uh, uh, you want the spider didn't hit a place. single one of you with a physical attack? <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, I didn't figure that I didn't see any poison. You think there's some in just start stabbing until you find some. I mean, it's a, it's a spider. Don't they all have poison? It's a scepter. I could try. I'm going to take my longsword and, like, pierce into its, um, back, whatever okay. you call um, this. <laughs> and then the will know it's spider blood, anatomy Jane? anymore. That's what uh, I go for as Lyra. <laughs> all I right. You can blood. give me a medicine roll. <laughs> medicine roll. Okay. Sure. <gasps> oh, 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 Lyra, in you, the butt. So you guys see Lyra kind of looking at it and going, hmm, in hmm, the butt. probably about there. Oh and it comes God, out God. covered in gooey stuff. Oh, perfect. Um, yeah, oh, you, 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 knew, you knew times? exactly where to stab it, Lyra, being the legendary ranger that you are. How, uh, how, Jane, how is it that you always roll really well on the things that would make your ranger actually legendary and not a liar that she is? I know, it's been <laughs> that's why. <laughs> it's been Lyra. Spider. Putting a snake Poison. in a bag. Yeah, okay, so like, um, on the, okay. so here's how that will work, because it kind of blade venom. On the next attack you make um, with that sword, mm -hmm. Um, it will do an additional 2d8 poison damage um, unless they make a DC uh, 14 con save, in which case they will take half. Okay, got it. So 2d8 extra poison damage on the next attack you make with your longsword. Thank you. And then after that, it's used. Okay. It's all in the maneuvering of your hand when you slice into it. Yeah, I'll show you. And I'll do the same thing, but probably pretty incorrectly. All right, <laughs> let's go. All righty. Um, you've still got just a little bit of time left on your glowing thingies because you still haven't cast another concentration spell. So, yep. Um, but of course, the spell does include uh, the spell duration does include all the exploring time and walking time and stuff like right. that. So it's getting it's getting very close to being gone. Okay. Um, yeah, we just keep um, exploring the path then. There right now. Okay. Alrighty. Down we go. Alright, you're gonna keep pushing these little glowy boys forward. Yep. Yep. And you're moving up behind them. God, okay. they have a ten minute this Spirit Guardian is a great spell for third level, holy shit. It is. I mean it it, it really can be, especially if you're having a lot of encounters in a short proximity kind of like now yeah <laughs> what yeah. you have been yeah it worked out i've never used a spell it's really good it's rather good now i use it every time <laughs> rather splendid no i don't like to do that it's no fun no use it every time no all the it's, time it's no fun all the time okay um the tunnel takes a sharp turn okay oh. and we turn with it and we turn around. And we go back. Oh, that's it. We can't. We can't go any further. We can't do symmetrical stuff. Oh. <laughs> Amber. 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 Is that your echo in the cave? 
No, I'm just glitching. Sorry. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Hey, I, no more. My mistake. I had a, I had a geographical glitch. <laughs> okay. And I'm going to say that that'll get you to there. And then, unfortunately, it fizzles out. Okay. Okay. But the little spiritual guardians certainly did their job, so... Okay, Uh, yep, up ahead of you, it takes another turn. Um, If you will, everybody can give me a check. And this check would be one of perception. Ooh, Christy! Natural 20! Still a little higher. Um. (laughs) Plus zero on perception. All right, all of you, (laughs) in fact, every one of you um, can hear something down the corridor. Um, It sounds like something like more than one something, numerous somethings skittering about. You can like like multiple things are moving down there. It, does it sound like they're coming towards us? Uh, or it no, just sounds it just sounds like they're they're actively moving. Hey um hey Lyra. Yes. Can you hear that? Oh I do. Might maybe you could uh Let's take a look at something. Yeah, maybe you could take a look ahead. I mean, this this armor is not conducive to like to the, the old sneaking. So maybe, maybe you could just take a look up there and see what you could see and let us know what's going on, so we can kind of you know game plan around it. It's nice of you to ask. Sure. Well, yeah, I don't uh, want to get caught up in there with this. No. <laughs> so I'm just for reference. I do have the long sword with poison and a shield out right now instead of my regular. Okay. Uh, um, so I'm gonna peek. Do you have any special vision? Uh, no, I don't. Then you can't see shit, because it's pitch black <laughs> down there. Uh, There's nothing here. Um, um, did one of you cast some kind of light spell on anything? we had. I think I took out a torch. Yeah. So... Okay, so you, you have a glowing torch. torch, then. Okay. But I'll put away uh, my shield and hold the torch out. Um, uh, um, okay. What? Yes? What? Speak up! Well, you do know that I can see with a spell ahead of us. No. How would what we have known? How would we have known that? Because what I did it before. Remember what before we rescued Lyra? I, I you know. Oh yeah, I, in the very I scouted beginning. ahead. Yeah, that's right. Oh, but I, didn't we get hit by something? Even though you did that. <laughs> I plum forgot, but sure. No I think bad. a door closed on us or something. It was something no, real bad. It was, it was the laser eyes, the laser corridor. Okay, so what you're saying is, if there's laser corridors over here, we you won't be able to help us. Well, I could see them. Oh, okay. well, I'm you, just letting okay. you know That's that something. I can if you want me to But you, you said Lyra so I, I, I don't Well because I plum forgot I don't know all your spells Yeah you gotta give us like a book or something we can check Give us something I'm not giving you my spell book you crazy? Well then how are we gonna know what you spell Elasticus when we finish this encounter We're gonna have a sit down by the fire And we're gonna learn about expressing our opinion And exuding more confidence mm-hmm. That's, That's a be. great idea you can just speak up. This, this is there's something you can do. This is not because that, I just did. Fine. You know who? You know who can help with that? No, no, no. Oh, oh. sorry. All right, all right. Sorry, sorry. Okay. Sure. <laughs> not, not the time. Not, not the time. Right. No place. All right. I'm okay. standing. Right. By the fire, though. Not. By the fire, though. Okay. It's going real hard. I'm saying though. It's bubbling up. It's bubbling up. Oh, I see ants. Back up. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, yeah. Um, as y'all stood there having a conversation and chit-chatting, the things that were going um, have made their merry way, or some of them have made their merry way oh up the corridor and uh, emerge around the corner. So these are like great big soldier ants, um, which are still pretty damn... I mean, they're about the size of a wolf, pretty much, to a mouse. Um, so, you know, they're pretty big. Um, and foreboding. Um, and... Right there. <laughs> and, oh boy, uh, we got if you would yeah, like, um, you can roll an initiative. See what mischief you're about to uh, get into. Jane, we're on the family feud here. We're looking for what is the worst sentence to hear at any picnic. <laughs> you said 
We got ants. Back up. Survey says. <laughs> <laughs> ding, ding. Number one answer. Number one answer. <laughs> Congratulations, Jane. Uh, <laughs> For some reason, you won the game because of that. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I need a Fifany initiative. Oh, he hates ants, too. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm Sorry, I got to roll mine. I was too busy being Fifany okay. feud. Alrighty. Um, so these ants come skittering around the corner. Um, their initiative is a sixteen, which will put them yeah, I don't right want to after them, I think they'll Lyra. The okay. Um, so they're just like puppy dogs, and they make a friend. So, yep, Lyra, mm -hmm. you mm -hmm. shout your warning: um, "Look out! It's spiders! Back up!" Or things, whatever. <laughs> spiders, not spiders. Uh, ants, back up. Um, yes. But you are going to have to face off against them. Um, We're so going to have to fight. Where okay. is my... Where is it? I've lost things. Oh, there. <laughs> Haven't okay. we all? Right? <laughs> Change it up. Here. Okay. Um, all right, Lyra, uh, even though they come rushing around the corner, they didn't really surprise you because you were aware of them. Um... Um, so you will still beat them in the initiative. What do you want to do? What what does it cost to toss my torch? Well, what does it cost to touch my torch? To throw your torch would be an action. <laughs> I'm not doing that. All right, I have the long sword that has poison on it, so yep, and I'm shield. going to attack one. Okay. Um, I'm going to attack the first one twice with my weapon here here we go <laughs> slay the ant slay the ant Level. uh you swipe and miss uh you swipe and Come on. hit Ooh. okay second that, one is a hit so uh you do seven points of damage but you get to uh it makes so it's gonna make a dc 14 con 14. save yeah um ants con bonus is two and it fails yes. um so it's taking Aww. an extra four points. Oh. And then... I'm no and then. <laughs> use Horde Breaker to do one no more attack then. on the right ant. Okay. Right ant attack. And right ant attack. And one more shot here. Dead ant. Dead ant. Uh, okay, you hit it for six. Great. Am I all out of poison, I'm assuming? Uh, yeah. Yep. Okay. Got one it. shot, that one use. such a waste. <laughs> Never mind. Such a crappy poison. That's pretty funny. <laughs> um, alrighty. Um, yeah, it is their turn. Um, they both dive forward going... Because that's what ants do. Um, but these are soldiery ants. They're not poison stingy ants. They're just bitey, chumpy ants. Uh, all right. First one lunges at you, um, and ooh, that hits. Okay, and I'm then the second one. You know what? I'm gonna save myself. Save oh. yourself! Oh God! Uh, that needed a plus six on oh. that. <laughs> okay. Um, so they both hit. Yeah. All right. Total is one d eight plus two. So uh. Total damage from both attacks. 16 Gosh. points of horrible, bitey, pinchy damage. It's got me! It's got me! <laughs> I don't think I've been hit in a really long time, so <laughs> surprising. I yelp. Okay. Alrighty. Um, with that being said, um, Fiffany. Um, what do you want to do? Um, I am going to cast, uh, let's see. So my spirit guardian just went down. I'm going to cast bless, oh, bless. on the, on the party. Well, bless your heart. Ding. Okay. Uh, which gives everybody. <clears throat> Whenever a target a makes D4. an attack roll or a saving throw before the spell ends, the target can roll a D4 and add the number rolls to the attack or saving throw. Alrighty. And uh, with my voice of authority, I am uh, 
Uh, I'm, I'm also going to move uh, to the front line here. Okay. Uh, well, no, actually, I'm not going to move the front line because I, I want to be just behind. Um, use use, uh, use Lyra as a meat shield. Lear here for now, yeah, and absolutely. I'm gonna I'm gonna um, I'm, I'm not behind you, babe. But you know what? Go ahead, go ahead, and get him again. Uh, and my voice of authority is gonna allow Lyra to attack the ant in front of her if she chooses to. Ooh, I choose to. Okay. Right now. Yeah. Uh, cool. Yeah, basically, it gives you a free attack. Yeah. Oh, Which you God. totally waste. Uh, <laughs> what the heck? It is your turn to roll the bad damage rolls tonight, apparently. Seriously. <laughs> it really is. Damn, uh, take that! <laughs> All right, well, not bad, I guess, but could have been better. Not bad, not bad. Yeah, that, that's like on, literally get, how get. it went. You could said, attack again, and she went like, what, now? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, now? Like that? <laughs> yeah, I guess. <laughs> Lasticus. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna move slightly over so I can see this little ant in front of me. Okay. That's not guarded, and I'm just gonna do a simple little cantrip, Firebolt. Firebolt! Um, will hit. Cool. Uh, which does 14 nice. points of damage to that one. Okay. And last but not least... Fennifar! Alright, I'm gonna run up. Oh, I love Stomp Ants! Hold on, let me get up here. <laughs> I'm gonna run up next to Lyra and whack the other one here. There he is. Ant attack. Alright, you smash the first one, uh, smash the first ant for 11. Excellent. Uh, do I get a second attack? But I move, so... Nope, this is D, this is 5e. You can do two attacks. I get yep. both. Okay. Yeah. Yep. I'm glad I asked. You get an attack action and a move action. Nice. And you hit it again. Ooh. Okay. 41. Good deal. Okay, lots of cracked carapaces on that ant. Okay. Um, Next turn, it starts out with Lyra. Um, you're kind of wedged on the front line there, Lyra, so... Uh, well, <laughs> I, g I gave her enough space to... That, like, my whole thing was to tell her, like, hey get out of the front line here. Yeah, so she, I, I would have left her room to... Okay, so uh, you've given her I can smush room. over. Gotcha, gotcha. Yes, that was the whole point of me telling her to be like, hey, get out of here, but hit him one more time, and then if she to wants to get... The, do you wish to back out, Lou? Um... No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think I'll stay there and continue to fight. Okay. You shall fight. fight. All right. Oh, thank you. I'm so brave. Um, you swipe um, and miss, uh, but you do hit it. Ooh, there's some good damage. Time. Okay. Alrighty. Okay. Uh, it is their turn. Wait, I forgot to do my horde breaker and do one more attack. Okay, on the one I to will the right. allow that because I haven't moved on yet. <laughs> have you um re have you repurposed your uh? Hunter's Mark? No, I haven't it, casted it might, that again. Yeah, it might have been too long to um, just move it. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, you probably should yeah, recast. Okay. All right. Um, the Horde Breaker missed anyway. Never mind. Yep. Okay. Um, the ants. All righty. Well, the first one is going to chomp on Lyra, but the second one will instead move its target to um, the other combatant. Lyra, 15. Miss. Okay, Fennifer. 14. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Um, so... Tiffany, okay. what would you like to do? Uh, yeah, I'm going to use... I mean, I know it's not the most exciting move, but I, I'm going to use my cantrip, uh, Toll the Dead again. It's the only damaging cantrip I have. It's like the only damaging cantrip <laughs> clerics have, so... Yeah, it's, 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 you That's know, you, you, it, it kind of, in some situations, it kind of pulls you into the warlock um, of uh, Eldritch, Bla Eldritch, Eldritch Blast. Blast. Yeah, Eldritch Blast. yeah, I know, yeah. I know. Well, I know. we're just not hurt right at the moment, so there's really not too much more command. Oh, so that, I got that's less right. I mean, going, you don't so. want to burn a whole bunch of uh -uh. slots on semi-utility spells, right? So. No, 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 no. So uh, I'm going to hit the one that um, is the most... I'm going to hit the one that's been hitting Lyra. That's the one I'm going to be hitting, so... Here's my roll. That's a 17, uh, 17 whizzy, whizzy save. Alrighty. Um, what are these 
Ants have, they have nothing, of course, on wisdom. Failed. Already, um, has taken damage, so, uh, yeah. Lots of necrotic damage for you. Um, 24, which one did you do that on? Uh, the one that, that Jane was attacking. <clears throat> so I think she's, she's more in peril. Okay. Um, 24. It is still up, but um, seriously damaged. Okay. Good job. Uh, let's see, Lasticus. Um, right. You're in the same boat um, as long as you can kind of see them, but it's got to be a spell that doesn't require an attack roll. Yeah, well, I was going to do, because they're in melee, I wasn't going to do anything more risky than Magic Missile, which is equally as boring and not as exciting as what that <laughs> okay. did. I'm casting it as a fourth level spell, so it's going to be six bolts total. I'm going to do three to each of them. Basically. Alrighty, split it. Nice. Sounds good. So, first three, and second three. Alright, so Very 11, fair. go to... Lyra's one. Lyra's one? Okay, um, that will destroy Lyra's and. Ooh. And then the ten will go to... Uh, what's your face? Yeah. And Fed that will out. actually destroy that ant. Nice! <laughs> good deal. That was more than six, two but... You know. That's one too many. <laughs> <laughs> And Fennifer, do you wish to do anything? Uh, well, if I see them just drop down, I'll just be like, Elasticus, look at you go. My goodness. It, 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 it's about the cleave, you know, the thief. Yeah. Well, I'm more, I'm oh, more don't proud forget, of, we're all blessed, I forgot. I'm more proud of Lyra here. She's still on the front line, baby. You don't have to, you don't have to do that. That's what we're here for. I'll get bit. I'll get bit if I back up. I can't. Oh, there's more. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, back up now. Get behind me. Get behind us. Get out of here. Everybody shut up. Go, Lyra, get behind me. I don't know if I... Can I? Because these are basically like moving their way up. In fact, you know what? Dead ants. It's not like you're going to loot them. <laughs> they might have poison sacks. I'm just gonna get rid of them. <laughs> right in their butts. Right in their butt. As we well, they might be different from spiders. We don't know. We have to we have to consult Lyra on where the poison sacks are. Yeah. Okay. Um. So yeah, more oh, the ants are advancing. Um. They literally just come like tearing around <laughs> the corner. And the first one, will do one, right, one lunges at Lyra and will. It's go march. It's go marching. Oh, of course. That's the name uh, of the song. One. One no. hits. Stupid. What about the other? <laughs> That's for finisher. Yeah. For me. A Twenty-three Sorry, and an no. eighteen. I, if it's the eighteen, I it does not hit. Okay, so just the one. All right. Yeah. Did you back up, Larry? You didn't. No. It wasn't didn't. my turn. Okay. okay. I think we're okay, still in order, right? I guess so. Of damage, Fennifer, from being bitten by an anti thing. Ooh. I did? Oh, wait, I didn't think I got hit. Uh, 20, the 23? For me. The 23 was for me? Yeah. Okay, then I think. Yep, yeah, that's the one that you said. 23 and um, me? You know what? Actually, <laughs> uh, actually let, me me. Retcon, let me retcon that just a little bit. What? Uh, because, Lyra, you would have probably got to act before then. Oh. So, what do you want to do? Pew! <laughs> okay. There we go. All right, there we go. Uh, in that okay. case, um, so you, you move oh. back. Is that all you're going to do? Yeah. All right, well, in that case, then, uh, let me give you an extra one, Fennifer, because she just backed out 19. Well, it doesn't hit, so... Okay, ha. good deal. All righty. Um, now it is Fiffany's turn. Okay, so you've seen three more of these ginormous soldier ants barge forward. Yep, that's fine. Uh, I'm just going to take a, a step forward. And, uh, God. No, I don't want to do that again. I want to cast tongues and talk to them. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Like, hey, ants, <laughs> what's up? <laughs> Holy crap! He's like, then you can them. Ooh. Let's tell the truth. Okay, hold on. Okay. Question. Yes. <laughs> no, I, I'm gonna save that. I'm gonna save that for something else. Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna use. Um, fuck! I don't want to do it again. I'm gonna do it again. 
to all the dead on the first one, hey, just the one in front okay of me to here. Do right? things um, well, oh no, 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 yeah, because we haven't hit any of these. I know. I just, I tried <laughs> to make some. There's, cool there's nothing else I can do to for this moment. Whack it with a stick. You're only yeah, limited by just, your own imagination. Ooh. Uh, well, it would be. It, it'll only be. I, I gotta roll three d8s. Here, I'll roll yeah, three so, d8s. Uh, well, let me if let me hits. let me roll it saving throw first. Okay. Um. Nope, it fails. So, uh, okay, so 3d8s. Three 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 okay, so That's instead you do 12 points of damage to the first ant. Okay, cool. Okay. Um, Lasticus. Yeah, see, Suddenly seeing more. A swarm of more ants come careering around the corner. <laughs> I mean, I feel like this is kind of a waste, but. Fireball! Well, I kind of I want a fireball, but I'm gonna cast a fifth level spell, Big B's hand. Oh shit! Okay, um, which I've, I've done before. Clenching fist, forceful. Oh. Clenching fist, yeah, clenching fist, and I'm gonna have it be like up here behind, like right where I paint. One creature or object within five feet. Well, it has a range of 120. Yeah, so I'm gonna put it. Right behind right, what they but, end. But if you're using clenching hand, if you do that, it's going to be. Oh, not. No, no, the, the. I'm doing the punchy one. The clenched fist. Right. The answer is a creature object within five feet of it, so I'm casting it behind. Make a melee this. spell attack for the hand using your game statistic. On a hit, the target takes 48. If you right. don't target a creature, it, there is no damage. Well, I'm, no, I am targeting. I'm targeting the one in front of Fennifer. Okay, sorry, I thought you were, like, talking about yeah, yeah, yeah. Gonna try to hit the area beh between them all. No, 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 it's just okay. a single attack thing. Gotcha. Um, yeah. The okay. dumbest move of all time. <laughs> I punch the ground. That scare them away? Yeah, they hate when people... The level yeah. five a spell. Slap. Right. No, so I, <laughs> I can... A little slap. It does a punch when it appears. I mean, I can do a punch. Yeah. So I'm I'm punching that one. Or 22 doing a punch. points of nice. force damage. Not the no. not the best punch I've ever seen on this show, but not bad. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> I don't okay. okay. Uh, that's is all that I'm all doing. you're doing? Yep. That's Jennifer. all I can do. Okay. Jennifer Mouse. I am going. Oops. I picked up the wrong thing. Okay, I'm going to uh, a smack. The ant. It was, I guess, right in front of me, the one everyone attacked me. Um, this one is the one that they've attacked. And... Oh, yeah. This one's damaged, and this one's damaged. Um, that's a hit for 13. Nice. Um, you continue to hit that one. Uh, and that is not a hit. Can I yeah, bless. my bless? Yeah, bless. Yep. Uh, you can use your bless. Uh, roll d4. Yes. Thank you, James. Come on, four. Yeah. Uh, a measly one. Fortunately, the AC is 14, so that still Woo! gets a hit. Oh, Bless yes. Benny! Woo! Bless for the win. Bless so, up. Um, you hit it for 15 more. Okay. Which uh, is exactly uh, enough to crush that ant. Nice. Excellent. So let me get rid of him. Fucking bless, dude. Alrighty. Um, and Lyra, you are up. What do you want to do? <laughs> Drop my sword, pull out my bow. Okay. Mm-hmm. Pull out your bow. Pull out your bow. I get right in front of Pull out your bow. That's so rude. <laughs> <laughs> like, right, I'm like, like. Thanks. Yeah, I lean against. <laughs> I lean against him for support as I shoot. Into the, um, I'm gonna use volley, so I'm gonna hit both of them. So, um, I'll hit the that ant first twice. <laughs> Time to lady. Yes. Sorry. <laughs> um, okay, so. Quick question, because yeah. you're making a ranged attack with an opponent adjacent. Um, let's see. Uh, blah, blah, blah. I'm sure. No, uh, it's not going to matter. <laughs> I'm just looking here. Well, you got blessed. You got blessed. You got blessed. Um, so, Lambo. The second one will definitely hit. The first one might with bless. It was. Oh, oh, it was oh, like oh, three, it was and it was like teetering. <laughs> And then I volley to the right and um, attack that once. <laughs> okay, which will hit. So you do a nine and a nine. Okay. Got it. All right. Sorry, last 
guess. Uh, it's okay. You're very comfy. <laughs> It's me with my aim. Thank you. Ooh. <laughs> You're making him blush. <laughs> you better cast good luck okay. because I swear to God. Um, it is their turn. Okay. Uh, oh, no. So we have, oh, let's like see, make sure we face them off. All right, so the first one on this side, it is going to make its clawy bites at Fiffany. Oh, it'll totally miss. The miss. And the next two. Ooh, that was a crit. Uh, and the second one. Oh, come on. Is a hit. Um, so that's a total of 3d8 plus 4. You don't get the extra bonuses. For, you don't get the bonuses on the dice roll. For 24 points of bitey damage. Ooh, so 24 points hurts. of piercing damage um, is nice. delivered to Her Holiness Benefer. <laughs> I've watched enough Ants, Canada. <laughs> okay. Um... Tiffany. Anybody here play the game uh, Sim Ant when it came out in like yeah, it was fun. the I was 90s? Good game. Was I nice. loved that game. Yeah, it's a good game. That's what it reminds me of. And I'm like, although oh, the, uh, the. I just looked it up. <laughs> yeah, the weird thing. Awesome. Sim, Sim Ant? Sim Ant. You had to like, yeah. build and raise an ant colony. Yeah, one of the things that like totally oh, sticks out in my head is when you would like feed or the queen would feed you, it was this really Ew. weird close-up clip, and they would go like that, Ew. and you see the food. It was, I don't know why that existed, Creeped but anyways, <laughs> I feel like I'm playing Sim Ant right now, and it's, it's making me very happy. Fifth? Is that um, yeah, Fifth, what do you want to do? You know what I'm freaking gonna do here. Of course. Oh, I just saw that. <laughs> I have to ask. I know, there you go. Oh, did you see the, the, the feeding part? Yeah. yeah. Isn't that weird? Picture. It's so gross. Gross. And I it, it does well not save, so um, it take takes twenty-seven. Damage. Which one are you dumping that on? The one directly in front of you? Uh, yeah, yeah, because I've hit that one already. Okay. All right, very badly hurt, but still there. Oh f damn! Okay. Um, Lasticus. Lasticus uh, will up. Yeah, so I'm gonna use my bonus action to do another punchy punch. Okay. With the handy. Uh, which one? Uh, left, middle, or right? Left. I'm still doing left. Always left. Because mm. just because it has two people on it, right? Okay. Ooh, nice. And then I'm firebolting the middle, like right between. So 22 points of. Ooh. And a firebolt. Okay, you heard a mode of fire at a creature or object within range. Make a ranged spell attack against a target. On a hit, yep. the target takes 1d10 damage. Or 3d10, because I'm level 11. Okay. And which one are you doing that on? The middle one? That's the middle one, because it's like the easiest I could see. Okay. Yeah. Um, so it does... 11. Uh, oh, wow, that was 3d10. That oh, was 3d10? Okay. Ew. <laughs> Ew. Yeah, that was a bad roll. Yeah, I understand. Yeah. It happens. <laughs> it happens. I get it. I get it. <laughs> All right, Fennifer, yeah. you're up. Okay. All right, I'm going to go for... In front of me again... Um, you strike that one for 14 points. Another one. Uh, that will miss. It's Ooh, bless. Bless. Yeah, bless. Uh, if you roll a four, you can get roll a hit. A four, baby. I'm gonna watch. You are. Oh! You are. Um, bless, baby. You count it. Please, be Lord. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, it's still damage. alive. But bottom line is. Um, the one in front of Fiffany and the and the, one of the ones in front of Fennifer are both very badly damaged, and one is not looking great. Um, Lyra, what you're okay. gonna do? Your bow, your bowlessness. You wanna lean up against me again? <laughs> yes, I do. Jump up in front of you. Leans I, in. Um... <laughs> Exactly. Let me attack the same ant I was trying to get earlier. Twice. Oh, 
bless, bless. Uh, which one are you bless, aiming bless, at? Which one is it? Bless, bless, bless. Oh, you'll hit it with bless for sure. Which one are you aiming at? Yeah, you got this. You can, well, you the can't bottom not. one? Okay. Um, so yes. that's... Oh, right. That's how numbers work. And with the bless, <laughs> sure okay, is. so that's 26. Uh, no, 16. Yes, yeah, 16. Okay. And then I'm going to volley the other two. I love this ring. Oh! 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 Natural 20! Wow. Damn, we're going 20s tonight, Lyra. Hey! Damn. Lyra, Lyra, Lyra. Oh, Okay, um, so an ad additional 10 to that one and a 10 to the other one, which ironically kills both of them. Ooh, let's go. Delete. This is some good teamwork here, guys. I got to say, we're like I'm loving it. We're a little we're setting them up up front and you two are just knocking them down in the back, you know, I love it. Okay. Oh, um, one this little friend I don't like. Oh, this looks like a de- this is the demon ant. <laughs> demon ant! Okay. The demon ant's oh, red like the wait. devil! Oh, I can't wait to smack that ant. Okay, so the devil first ant, ant um, is gonna attempt to bite Fennifer. We'll get a twenty-one. Yes. Yeah. 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 Um, is going for Fiffany. Oh! Oh no! Ouch! Damn oh boy! It Oops! I knew it's coming. I knew it. Yes. I, I, I oh, seen it. Goodness. I seen that little bevel and coming. I'm oh, like, oh. I hate seeing those red fangs sink into your flesh. Oh. All right. Okay. Um. Well, the nip, <laughs> the nip was very insequential. Only nipped you for four. Ow, I ever. did the thing where I go. I say ow first, and I'm like, oh, that didn't really do nothing. Oh, that Need a constitution ant. save. It's a slow burn. Um, and you is would it... need a 14. Is it for poison? Um, it is. I'm a dwarf. Okay. So I have advantage, or advantage against poison save or resistance? What Which one? It, what does it say? Or immunity. I'm looking. I'm looking. <laughs> uh, where would that be? Features? Yeah, I'm looking. Racial traits. Uh, here we go. I think it's it resilience that they have. Dwarven resilience. You have advantage on saving throws against poison. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, and resistance against poison damage. So. Um, so let me save first. Or let me try to save first. And you said it was a con save, correct? Con save of fourteen. Yep. Okay. And you've got Ooh. a two roll. I got a pretty. So. I got a pretty good con save here, so. Hell yeah. Uh, yep. Yeah. Okay. Um, so you would only take half the damage, but then you say you also have poison resistance, right? Correct. Correct. Um, Another like half, right? So yeah, so 25% total, I think. Let's see. Because I think. This is the first character I've made that has a strong constitution because I don't like being <laughs> out of action or <laughs> I have high wisdom, high wisdom and high con. I'm like, you're not going to take my mind over wait, and you're not going to shut my body down. Okay, I refuse. <laughs> Double checking the damage on those. Okay, so... Yeah, so... Um... So it would be 3d12, so let me roll it. So you take half of this, which is... Oh, shit. So that Thank you God. take 10, <laughs> and then you bump it down, so you take 5 points of damage. Woo! Oh, whoo. That's not that a lot. Been. <laughs> no, it's not a lot at all. Not a lot. Um, so basically, it bit you for four and, and burnt you or stung you. It's a stingy one? For five. It's, it's a stingy one? That one's it's a stingy, stingy one. Yeah. one. Oh, God. Hey. All right. Uh, fifth all right, all right. Let me tell you, though, that would have hurt a lot more if I weren't a dwarf. So just, I'm not trying to downplay it. Just I'm just saying. <laughs> this is bad news. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, uh, Do something cool. I, well, I, I'm doing something that's really working, so... uh okay, do that. I, I have been. Okay, I'm just Give sorry. Me. I don't want to get hit by that red 
Hey. Well, the, luckily you don't have to be right now. So I'm gonna um, I'm casting Tolden oh. on the black one because oh. it's been hit. Did it go? No, not yet. Hello. Takes a minute. Right. There we go. Ugh. Not the best, but something. Attempts at save and, and, and it's been damage. Ooh, Ooh. Okay. Uh, okay. Points of necrotic damage. Yes. And that is the end of Ooh. that ant. Leaving only... All right, now, come over here and help me with this one. Help me with the stingy one. Help me with the stingy one. Elasticus. I am... I'm imagining these accents in a tiny mouse voice. <laughs> That's exactly how they are. I just read that. <laughs> That's hilarious. Can someone, like, voice mod the stingy one? Help me with the stingy one. Help me with the stingy one. I'm going to. I'm going to. I'm going to use Dragon's my big piece hand, time. not to punch but to grasp. I want to try to grapple the red one and crush it. So. Your baby's hand. Oh, your big beast hand. I thought baby. you. you. Baby. I was like, I was what? Hand. <laughs> big beast hands. So you're using to... grasping. You I'm using grasping hands. Okay, yes. The hand attempts a grapple. Um, it's an athletics check, or... right? So, yep. Let's see. The use of the hand strength score. Um, so what's your what's its strength score? It's a twenty six hand. So, I mean, I, I already have my athletics uh, skill to accommodate for the extra strength. So, this is the athletics grapple attempts. Okay, which means it can take two d six bludgeoning damage. Seventeen, if... but I mean, if it if it yeah, it has to roll higher than that. Um. Right? Okay. But she does not. So it, it takes that wonderful damage. You'd have been better to punch it. <laughs> yeah, but it's gra- it grapples, right? So, but it does. So, um, yeah. So basically, um, the hand is like locked onto it, like gripping around it. Yes. Um, so it can't attack on its turn. That is great. Right. Um, grapple. Grapple those little mandibles. Um, so basically, um, I don't think it has any abilities that it can use. Oh, maybe it does. I need to check. Uh-oh. Um, I mean, it is ten times stronger than its body, so... <laughs> maybe it just takes a little bit. No, but it, it, still... it just stops it, you know? <laughs> Little Let's red see. ants tails. Okay. Um, it spits webs too. Fire webs. <laughs> no. <laughs> stingy webs. Not stingy webs. No. Okay. Yeah, that's what I thought. All righty. So yeah, its movement counts as zero. Um. And it can't benefit from any bonuses to its speed. The condition ends if the grapple is incapacitated. The condition also ends if the effect is removed. So basically, um, it stops it being able to move. Doesn't stop it attacking in melee. If anybody stays in melee. Got it. Okay. I believe that that is what the grapple condition is. You said okay with a doubt, so I'm gonna now I'm gonna look it up. No, and no, see. no, no. That, <laughs> I mean, I, I'm not the one getting attacked by this thing, so I don't really care. You might be if I throw you over there. Yeah. Yeah. Well, oh, okay. Bring it. Are you gonna use your little fucking pitchforks or whatever? No, I, I Gore. I, I think. You're, I mean, you're right. It are, can um, use this action to escape. I can use it. Uh, it can use its action to escape, or it can use its action to bite. Right. Uh, it just cannot move while it is grappled. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> that is right. <laughs> um. Okay, Fenifer. Yes. I'm going to strike this little stingy baby. That the stingy okay. thing. Yeah. Oh. Uh, bless, 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 bless. Plus, plus, plus. Nice. Uh, we should make that a hit for 15. Okay, and one more. 
And that's just enough to hit on just its own. Okay. Okie dokie. Uh, it's still alive. Valera, you're up. Valera. 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 <laughs> you're the toughest little group of mice ever to <laughs> ever to cross the cornfield. <laughs> Your voice, your You're so quiet like now. You're like a million miles away. We can't hear you at yeah, all. At all. We're blessed twice, but yeah. Now you're muted. Uh, uh, <laughs> what's going on over there? Did you blow your speaker out? Jane? Yeah, did something loud happen? We can't hear at all. We're not kidding. Yeah, there's nothing. Yeah, now we can't hear you at all. But we heard very, very quiet Jane, and now we hear no Jane. So Jane? normal Jane, and now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. That's for the. So one of those hit. One blessed. You one blessed. Okay. How about? Yeah, there we go. You're back. You're back. You're back. There we go. It just shot my audio down to like twenty percent. I don't know what happened. Oh, nice. Whatever. Oh, it must be something to do. You might. You must have that light. Auto, auto thing. The auto right? thingy engaged. No, yeah. I don't want that. How do I unengage that? Uh, okay. Uh, I'm assuming okay. which one of the two did you roll that for? Well, she gets it for both, right? Just yeah. one, I think. Right? The bless? You get it for both attacks. What? Right? What was every attack? Why wouldn't I you? It was just once per turn. Uh, let me look. <laughs> you might be right. Whenever a target makes an attack, I believe is what it is. Wow. Yeah, the yeah. So it should be for both. Or the target oh, makes like an attack roll. Hey oh. Okay, uh, and you hit with both of them anyway, so it doesn't bless. matter. Bless, baby. Uh, twenty-three. Okay. Okay, it is almost dead. There is little to nothing left of this thing. Um. It is its turn. Being an ant, it no. is going to attempt to try to grapple out of it. And it will not. That's all it gets to do. Um, so, Fiffany. Mm -hmm. You can do the honors. <laughs> mm -hmm. I think I will. Look at this. Look at you, dumb little devil ant, saying you could sting me like that? I don't think so. Yeah. Uh, you want to you wanna know what happened to your other little eight legged friend? Oh, no. I, 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 I melted the brain <laughs> out of his eyeballs. So, guess what? He says, I don't care. Gone. I'm not an eight. eight I oh, that's not the right spell. Spell the I saved it. I saved it. Yeah, you saved the ant's life. Now he'll be our, like, our friend. A good gone. Like a bell, but also saying gone, you know? Like a really cool... Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, that's yep, great. Uh, that's it didn't save. It is destroyed. You destroy the final ant. Yee-hee! Woo! I love right. big old bugs. Those are fun. Well, that one didn't sting you. You're lucky it didn't sting you because it would have got you. Trust something. me. Got I it. felt it. I felt this. I felt the the, the, the poison, the venom coursing through my veins. But then, but then I just I just prayed on it for a moment to be cleansed of the, of the demonness, and peel work shone down upon me and just sucked it right out. It's beautiful. I love that. I'm gonna cut off the head of the ant and put it in my bag. Oh, what I'm are we what, do? The red I'll ant. I'll see what happens. All when right, now that's just. Again. Oh, I see what you. Yeah, I see what you're saying. <laughs> Uh, you'll have a little, you'll, you'll have a little tiny ant in maybe, your bag. Or maybe you'll have a giant ant head. You never know. All oh, right, and what would you do with it? Show it off like I did. You see, Look what I, I killed. A place where I stay, <laughs> and I put all the heads of things I, I've killed that I like. Oh, so you're gonna oh. mount it? Okay. Yes. Uh, are, are you gonna like, you know, bag it because it's leaking for leaking? Threw it in Look the back. Fantasy. That's right. For fantasy. I'll clean it up later. <laughs> Hey, whatever she wants to do in her bag is her business, you know? It's her bag, you know? Whatever yeah, her, her bag is, her bag. It's her bag. Okay. Uh, is, is it, is it, wait, Lyra, Jane, isn't your bag that quiver of Alona? Doesn't have space, like pocket it dimensions? It has a lot of space, yeah. So how are you going to clean a pocket dimension? <laughs> <laughs> just I'll like clean up a ant brain just, yeah, just leaking out into the void. Right. Yeah, suddenly a, a letter will come fl flying out of the thing. Can you please stop spilling ant brain in our in our dimension? <laughs> this is not appropriate. We don't approve. You get a fine for littering. 
Ah. Hey, I'm I'm feeling pretty uh pretty hurt here, y'all. I don't know about you, but oh, then and you're right. right. Those I'm, I'm, a number on me. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a little hurt too still, but uh, uh, oh, all right. See, well, let me see if I've got anything. Hold on, I don't want you to. I'll keep watch. Well, okay, Lance. Let's, let's get how, how how bad you think you're feeling? Like bad? On a scale just one to like, ten. <laughs> no, uh, no, just point at the about, face. Uh, about about <laughs> thirty two over fifty seven. Bad. All right, I wasn't asking for the exact oh, I'm, moment, but... I'm, feel, I'm winded. I'm I'm winded. You know, oh, see, you're all right. Moderate. I'm, well, I'm you know. Eating, like everywhere. So. Oh, you need you need you you don't got it. Are you? Uh... Uh, you know what? I actually I had already used my okay. little uh, pool. All right, all right, all right. Well, uh, okay. Pull the juice. All right, we yeah. say that. Pull the juice. Don't my really like it. Don't really like it. That's what uh, let's see. So who you uh, <laughs> what, what slots do you have left, and what do you? Yeah, want I got, to I got decent because I haven't cast too yeah, many spells. If you've got any. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna cast a level four uh, cure wounds. Oh, hold on, let me see. Well, uh, yeah, oh, check right. Out. Yeah, mm. yeah, cure, cure four, uh, cure wounds. How would I? Here, I'll cast forty-eight. Yeah, it's just 48. I'll just show the spell info. So. Yeah. Uh, one D8, and then every at second I add a D8. A D8. So 48. So 48 right? yeah. Okay, so this Ooh, one's I'm for. Ready. Okay. Give this one's me. for. All right, baby. Oh, Healer, right. please heal this vessel. Make her strong no again. Worries, make no her worries. 17. Ooh, 17 right. points of radiant light. All right, all right. And then I'll cast a uh, level. Ooh, which one do I want to use here? Don't want to use. That's scrumptious. Okay, I'll use a level uh, a level two slot for Laskus since he said he's all right, but um, okay. he just needs a little pick me up here. So two d eight for for a lasty. Uh, okay. Also, no, they they both get plus five to your spellcasting modifier. Yeah. Oh yes, you thank five you. Five because of your spellcaster level. Yep. Okay, so twenty two for. Oh, so I get five. Uh, not, not your spellcaster yeah. level, your spellcaster modifier, right? Which is five for me because yeah, I have a yeah, and then so fifteen, so twenty, 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 fifteen. Yeah, twenty-two and fifteen. Nice. All right. Uh, that, that, thank Ooh. you. Is that better? Is that all right? Anyone, anyone, uh, need, anyone need a little more? Anyone need? Yeah. Lyra, you all right? I think I can. I think I'm all right. Yeah. Lyra, baby, you good? I'll be okay. Okay. Well, if you need something, you just holler for you for your mama. Okay. I certainly won't do that. Why? <laughs> you aren't my mother. Well, no, but I'm like your Mom. spiritual mother. Right? Momsy. Mom's, yeah. Mom's the word. Mom, Mom is the word. All right. <laughs> uh, well, I mean, so are you leading the way here, Lyra? Are you uh, leading the way well, with her Well, it sounds like torch. last just volunteered. Uh, oh, yeah, he... um, go ahead. All right. Uh, are you sure he should be leading the way? Well, didn't he have a spell that he could, he said he could see? Stuff? But we're doing well, some, well, regardless. Yeah, I don't think we need it. I, I don't hear any. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't hear any little skitter scatter. I think we're all right. Skitter scatter, let's get at her. Skitter scatter, let's get at her. I think we're okay. okay. Well, I mean, putting my sword and shield away, I just have my bow up and a torch again. So. All right. I'll follow. I'll follow right behind her. Yeah. All right. Okay, uh, it opens into a much larger chamber. Um, <clears throat> again, there are lots of pieces of kind of um, like semi-decomposed insects and stuff in here. This is probably the chamber that the ants were in. Um, let me see, do we have... Um, Who, who has proficiency in nature? I'm sure Lyra does, but anybody else? Does she though? I don't know. Does she? <laughs> <laughs> I think she just gets real lucky on rolls. Yeah. But if I remember, I don't. Um, I don't remember. No, I, do I don't. Have That's what I thought. <laughs> in that case, forget I said anything. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't have it either. That's an intelligence thing. It's not my bag. Okay. Not my thing. Um, yep, big open chamber, but it does definitely continue on 
out the other side. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to skirt along. Worst this. ranger ever. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I'm going to follow suit. Uh, hey, what, 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 what are we doing this for? What are you doing? Oh, are we sneaking? We sneaking? I don't know. It's just just the best method. Stick to the walls. Oh, okay. Okay, stick to the walls. All right, I got Never it. Avoid any potential trap door spiders that are right here. We're learning how to be a Nets. ranger now, guys. This yeah, we're cool. learning how to be. This is great. This I love is so it. cool. You're so rangering. You're doing rangering. Yeah. <laughs> I love, I love Brian. Sneaking, 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 sneaking. <laughs> Look right on my horizons. Okay. All right, we made it. Okay, okay. All right, so go ahead. Here we go. Okay. <laughs> we'll get in this way. Okay. Do we hear sounds of ants yet? No, we have heard no anti sounds yet, no, like it's a like given. Keep going. <laughs> well, we all know there's okay. In fact, four. The corridors and chambers have become decidedly quiet. Uh, I don't like that a lot. Maybe something's wrong. Oops, sorry. Probably know we've been fighting, so they're all gathered in some room waiting. (laughs) They've all gathered into a small army ready to attack with one major assault. Um... (laughs) Well. Okay. Uh. I need to. Where's my sheet? There it is. This is a long way in. I'm just checking something, Gore, but I would be still following behind her. Okay. Just so you know. Suddenly, business deck attacks. I'm not left. <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, still, as you wander down the dark, Uh, dark, (laughs) dirty earthen tunnels, you have nothing else has happened at all. No sounds, no. It's become eerily quiet. Is it maybe um? Is it maybe too quiet? I think so. Dun 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 dun. dun. Miss Lyra. Yeah. Yes. Um, you think my is there some, is there some sort of animal that like, eats quiet or something? You know what I mean? Is that the thing? <laughs> she doesn't know. Like, well, that doesn't. Well, I don't know that she doesn't know. That's, yeah, the, that's oh, the thing. You know, I have. I was no just idea. being facetious because she doesn't have ranger there skills. There is a shadow creature. I thought once that oh. every time um, the shadow would engulf an area. Oh, if there's one thing we don't like more than demons and devils, it's shadows. And you want to know why? Why? Because there's no light in them. No light. <laughs> they have no light. And that's it's no light at all. It's the worst. I, I mean, the silence might be a welcome. I don't even like my own shadow. That's how much I hate shadows. <laughs> what was that? What was that last case you were saying? Well, you know, I, I like to read in silence. That's what? Why? That sounds boring. What, do you read out loud? Sometimes. You don't like to read with like a bunch of like rigmarole going all around? <laughs> <laughs> you know, like a hullabaloo? Uh, no, no, I like to, to study what I'm reading. Sure, but, you know, you don't like to have like a little, uh, yeah, you don't like to have a little, uh, a, a chamber quartet oh, plan. Here. Oh, Take a look. okay. So, um, <laughs> the corridor kind of divides and actually takes two separate paths. The left path seems to have like an indentation where water is like laying in it. Um, the other seems to be absolutely clear and safe. I was guess, <laughs> what do you make of this? Uh, a fork in the road? Okay, thank you for that. I'm talking about the water right here. Is it safe to step on? <laughs> We're underground. <laughs> water. I, I don't, it looks like a, a puddle. Well, Here's what I'm thinking with my range of skills. Um, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It looks like, you know, like, oh, let's avoid that because it's water, and then we'll go down the other path, and then there'll be a nasty surprise, and turns out the path of the water was the safe one. Oh, you know well, I mean? 
like like a, a you you spring a trap and a boulder rolls at you really fast, right? Like like that it happened to me once, you know. <laughs> God, when I was Indiana Jones. (laughs) (laughs) That's what you're trying to do here. Uh, I, 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 is there any creature that ambushes you in water? Alligator? Shots? Crocodiles? Snakes? Piranhas? Snakes? Worms? (laughs) In a mouse? In a mouse? Gravy. Gravy. Very small rocks. Every kind of bug, probably. That, I mean, I would. we fought in the ocean? That, that wasn't a demon, it was a demon. <laughs> Stop saying demon. Okay, you call whatever you want. I know what it was. I saw it with my own two eyes. Demon <laughs> demon. Put up a very demon vibe. Uh, unless, I mean, the, the only thing I can see is that the water would make noise, right? I mean, if we alert, you know, splash it. But otherwise, I can't, I Run can't and jump imagine. Splash, splash, splash. Is there a pebble on the ground? I'm going to look for a pebble to toss it in. Um, you can like probably pull one out of the dirt on the side of the whatever, or okay. dig one up out of the. Okay. Yeah, I mean there are step. there are pebbles. I mean they're not really pebbles; they're more like large boulders to you, really. But you can find them and and throw one in. Okay, let's see if it's steep. Ready? I'm gonna toss the pebble right in the middle. Okay. Just a rock. Any rock. There we go. Perfect. Not that big. <laughs> it's a strong mouse to look that little. All right, you hurl it. Um, oh, and it disappears in the water. <laughs> really? Yeah. It like. Oh. It's blush. So it's not a puddle. It keeps going. Uh, well, I mean, there, it's it was a rock. It's, I mean, it would have to probably be at least as deep as your knees. Okay, uh, I'm gonna do the same thing actually on this side and toss them. <laughs> Trust me, I'm on to something. I don't know how this ranger stuff works, so I'm all ears. I'm on to something. Okay. Throw the rock and it goes. Th- Onto the ground. Dead. <laughs> now I'm gonna hug the wall here and search the walls and the ceiling for any traps, I guess. <laughs> Dirt. Look at that. Wow. Just as I suspected. <laughs> Dirt. <It's so> stupid. <laughs> Investigation. I would not play with you in the playground if we were kids. <laughs> <laughs> I saw you doing this. That's serial killer shit right there, you know? <laughs> kind of check that I make for that core. What are you checking for? Traps on the walls or ceiling floor of this of this corridor. Um, do you have that skill? No. Um, <laughs> then you can make a perception <laughs> skill roll to see if you notice have. anything out of the ordinary. <laughs> Okay, a 21. Um, I mean, it, it looks the same as all of the other tunnels that you have passed. There seems to be nothing particularly different about this, other than the fact that it's split, okay. which is the first time that you've actually seen the tunnels split at all. All right, come this way, unless you wish to get your boots wet. No, I don't want to get no. my boots That's wet. That's the trap. <laughs> it makes your boots wet. <laughs> Trench foot. I hate that. These are yep. suede on the inside. I can't have that. Mm-hmm. Okay. Did it. <laughs> <laughs> we successfully navigated this intricate <laughs> trap. <laughs> you know, the irony of it is, as I was putting this thing together, I was like, this is, they're going to spend forever trying to figure out why this is here. the episode would end here. <laughs> discussing a puddle. Alrighty. As Lyra continues on. (laughs) 
or you evil bastard. I know. <laughs> well, he knows that we like, I wonder how things. long that they will actually ponder <laughs> this. <laughs> <laughs> you little stinker. I, I'm going to say that there is a trap there and that we successfully navigate it. Right, as far right. as you know, right? <laughs> <laughs> right, it continues to go on down a corner. Wow. This place is huge. Well, probably not. We're just mass, so. <laughs> yeah, it's probably like this big. Yeah, probably. <laughs> oh. oh, where are you going, Dad? <laughs> Secret passage! <laughs> oh no! The walls have eaten her! <laughs> this thing doing it keeps like jumping over there for some reason it's trying to follow matt yeah that's what happened to me i just kind of <laughs> teleported okay um so lyra give me a perception check please okay um yes you are aware of a small draft to your left um, as you notice that um, while there is a shadow there, it isn't actually a wall. Um, like uh. the... <laughs> okay. Turn around. Oh, shit. And what the fuck is that? <laughs> no. So like um, we'll go snake. ahead and little reveal this snake. little surprise. Oh, I wonder how tiny it is. Cute little snoot. Oh. <laughs> and I was like, like, okay. Ah! Uh, so, oh shit. Um, there is no surprise, but no one gets to act before it. So anybody rolls in. Everyone roll initiative, but um, gosh. Oof. At the end of the day, it is going to attack before. Ooh. I'm running out of initiative paper. <laughs> okay. 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 So we've got. Let's see. Lyra on a sixteen. Uh, Lasticus on an 18. Wow. Fiffany and too. Fiffany on an 18. Mm -hmm. And then Fennifer on a 10. One up the rear. And let's roll for this thing. Um, uh, oh! Of course. Uh, Ugh. Oh, which too many makes, 20s. Which makes that completely redundant. Ooh. Anyway, okay. Um, so, you feel the draft, and no sooner have you felt that draft that you guys see a ginormous snakehead burst out of the side and attempt to bite Lyra. No, not Lyra! Uh oh, your sound thing again. Sound thing? Oh, there it is. Okay. Fine. Okay. I adjusted. Um... Oh my god. Okay, by some stroke of luck, Lyra's <laughs> luck probably, um, <laughs> it snaps as she like eek, jumps forward <laughs> and it like goes and basically between like the head bite, dives out and snaps right between Biffany and Lyra. Um, putting Lyra on one side. Uh, what? So um, based on that. Um, Okay. Um, Thiffany and Lasticus both get to act at the same time. So it shot out and went, Ksh! but it's kind of withdrawn back into the hole. So you can't. S well, let me let me rephrase that. Um, Thiffany can see it. Lasticus, you cannot. Okay. Uh, so is the hole? The hole's just like a little dirt hole or something, or like, I, what is the wall? I can't really see the. Yeah, basically, it was like so. Like it burrowed. Is it a burrow or is it like a little? You see what I'm saying? Uh, can you not see it? I, I can, but I'm asking like, okay. what what is what, um, what the so size? Yeah, are. It, it's like it had, it had kind of like burrowed itself in, and then it had just like put its face right up against the hole. Gotcha. So it's trying to like masquerade as the wall. 
Okay, but but the walls is dirt essentially burrowed yeah, yeah, dirt. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, that's that's all I'm asking. Yeah, all of this um, has been dark. Okay, well you know what? It came in super clutch last time, so I am casting bless again. Okay, all right. Um, because that really helped. Uh, so I I bless up everybody there, and um, I am able to with embodiment of the law if I cast a spell. Of the enchantment school Which using a slot is yep i can change that to a bonus action mm -hmm. um and still have a regular action right uh doesn't allow you to break the spell rule though don't forget correct i can't cast another spell yep but, but you um, still do have a technically have an action which is, I mean, the only thing I can really do is attack this thing. Mm -hmm. So I think I'm gonna like almost instinctively and defensively sort of just like Belt bap it at it. Mate. Yeah, okay. like ah, like almost as a reaction thing. Like <laughs> my first instinct is to cast bless on everyone, just be like get back from that, get away from me, and, and swing at it. So it's not my best, but figure might as well give it a shot. Okay, swat away. All right. Got this big old snack. If a snack. Yeah. The snack. Roll type yeah. regular. Obviously. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, you whack it on the nose for eight points of damage. Not bad. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, Lasticus, so you're aware that, I mean, you saw this thing shoot out and dive back in, and you just saw him kind of go, ah! Yeah, I'm going, I mean, without being completely aware of the blessed spell that he's casting, I'm going to move into, well, fifth and he's casting, I'm going to move so I can see it. Okay. And because it was so surprising, I'm instinctively going to cast Banishment. Banishment. Okay. Which, to give us some time if it works, basically. All right. So you attempt to send one creature that you can see within range to another place of existence. The target must succeed on a charisma saving throw or be banished. Um, if the target is native to the plane of existence you're on, um, you banish the target to a harmless demiplane. While there, the target is incapacitated, uh, and basically it lasts for one minute. And it's concentration. Um, yep, so you got to concentrate on maintaining your banishment, um, and it needs a DC 17 charisma save. Yes. And it's a snake. It doesn't have any bonus charisma. I mean, it is a really good-looking snake. Snakes are hella sexy. Yeah, they are, but stat-wise it doesn't. What? Um... Okay. Um, Don't worry about it. For all intensive purposes. I don't know why that keeps happening. Uh, he oh. just made the snake disappear. Okay, he's gone invisible, everyone. It's gone invisible. No, oh, no. <laughs> I'm going to start nice. kind of like swinging in front of myself. Nice. Like, stop, stop, stop. I have moved it to a, a demiplane temporarily so we could. I don't know, strategize really quickly before it comes back and we kill it, you know? My net. I'm going to take my net out. I'll just, so just leave it there. We just have this net fall on it. That, that's a big snake. Are you sure your little net's going to work? Oh, my. How big's my net? I'm going to take it out to see if it's <laughs> Oh, shrunk. boy. Um. So how long is he going for? Like like 60 seconds, like a minute. That's oh, it. cool. Well, there goes my spell. You're welcome for blood, no, no. everyone. <laughs> I, can, I can remove it. I can stop concentrating before that. If we get in position so we can all be in a well, place. Well, I'm in position. I'm right here. What do you want me to do? Okay, oh. where do I go? Where do I go? Come up here. Come up here. Okay, okay. 30 seconds. I'm ready. I'm ready. Get behind it. Can I yeah, go there we go. Here? There we go. Yeah, yeah, you can climb in there. Perfect. Okay. All right, here we go. All right. We are a great team. I love this. Seconds. Great team. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Okay, so I'm everyone, ready. Be ready. ready. I'm and ready. I'm ready. Gonna... Hey, bring it back. I'm stopping my concentration <laughs> on it. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> oh, we still so scary. Um, <laughs> and it reappears. So I will argue that the snake will be, because it stipulates it is incapacitated when it's in the other plane. Yes. So it is fair to assume the second it suddenly reappears, it would be somewhat disorientated. So I would say, much like it surprised you, um, everybody. So it's, yeah. Um, it's not going to get to go first, so uh, you will all get to go before it uh, in this round. So, Fiffany, what do you want to do? I am... I don't like the snake <laughs> jumping out at me and my friends like this. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to cast uh, 
I'm casting Guiding Bolt. Okay. At level six. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, wow. yeah, yeah. Fuck it up. If it hits, so. <laughs> got it, you got it. I'll roll the. Um, Come on, people. Does, do, oh, do I get uh, advantage because Jane is standing behind it? Um, I think she's threatening, I would assume. But not your call. She's not. No. Okay. She hasn't acted yet. Got it, got it, got it. Okay, okay, that makes sense. Um, okay, so here's this. Oh, yeah, baby. All right. Uh, it needs a 17. Uh, 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 no, 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 this isn't a save. Uh, this is a, just an damage. attack. No, no, I know. It's 17 oh, okay. damage. Okay. Um, not the best. But I get to add a second level or higher, second, third, fourth, fifth. So five more D8 or D6. Uh, that, that's what I was looking at because it's four, It's given you 46. So you've got, because um, it's D6, is not D8s. Correct. Um, I get, so I get five more. So let's see. Second level or higher, the damage increases by D6 for each spell slot above the first. So, um, yeah. Okay. Five D6. Five D6. Okay. Pretty average all the way around. Okay. Thirty-two okay. points of radiant damage. Okay, nice. Um, Fuck yeah, on that, you demon snake! Last. Um, <laughs> radiant damage. Look at it. Look how radiant that is. Okay. Ooh, it was beautiful. Um, and Lasticus, at that same same moment, what are you doing? I am doing a simple fireballs. Oh my god, is that really 3d10? Wow. It Good is. Job, two, two, and two. Oh yeah. my god. Six points of damage. <laughs> uh, your your firebolt was diminished by the radiant light, clearly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, uh, Lyra. <laughs> All right, um, since I am back here, can I tell if the snake has a stinger uh, on the back of his tail? Uh, it does. Does the snake have a stinger? What? Oh, do you know snake anatomy? Huh? Um, no, it, this is not one of those snakes that has a stinger on the end. It's not a stinger snake, Jane. You know, the <laughs> normal <laughs> stinger snake. What kind of snakes have stingers? What kind of snakes have stingers? It's just a rattle. That's all they got. That's all they got. Yeah, they don't do that. <laughs> 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 nice snake bite, the right, Jane? They don't. This is not a scorpion. Nip at you. I mean, oh my scorpion? God. To be fair, she is from Florida, and everything there is way worse than. It has a stinger else. on it. So everything has a, every insect Florida has a stinger. Snakes have stingers. I totally not thought there. there were stingers on tails of snakes. <laughs> oh, Jane. Um, somebody <laughs> clip this whole thing right now. Jane. A minus to There's nature, not. guys. A minus. It's so confusing. I mean, I'm a <laughs> hashtag Microsoft. I'm an artificially intelligent <laughs> being, and I know Norman, the answer. Norman gave up on you. Norman said, get out of here. He said, no. no I'm so like, even, I'm, uh... even I'm smarter than this. Oh, sweet Jane. Sweet, sweet oh, Jane. Oh Everyone, uh, please, someone find Lyra a snake that has a stinger. The, snook, the stinger on the tail. <laughs> I guess I'm thinking of a scorpion. Yeah. Well, yeah. Gore, is yeah. there a stinger on this tail of the snake? Surprisingly, <laughs> <laughs> there isn't, actually. Oh, um, Oh, thank God. I mean, it is. That was a close me. one. That could have been. I could suppose. have been. I mean, also, um, the spell could have had. The snake could have had arms sword. and cast spells, but. <laughs> oh, my God. Wow. That's I'm trying to Google it. Deserve. Well. And, and that, that's, a, is, that's what you deserve. It is a big You deserve to miss with the Wait. first attack and do minimum damage okay. with the second attack because you were too busy trying to figure out. <laughs> Does it have a stun? <laughs> What kind of ranger are you? Man? Well, it's honestly, it's perfectly in character for. I know, Lyra. I love, we love you, Jane. We've got to have we, a stinger, we really right? Do. It's like, oh, it has, has a stinger somewhere. You're like super <laughs> distracted by it because, like, looking around. Um, That's uh, why I'm back here, obviously. Uh, 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 oh, is that a stinger? Oh no, no. Uh. <laughs> oh, Jane, we love you. Oh, we do. We do. I this is we I'm almost to. thirty, and I thought <laughs> that some snakes had stingers on their tails. Well, I don't I'm know. Trying, if a single I'm trying. I'm trying to find one. I can't. I'm googling as fast as I can. Don't, I can't find a single snake. One. You learn <laughs> something today, James. How the snakes work. <laughs> God damn it. No Fennifer, um, <laughs> if you can keep a straight face and are not like shocked by Lyra's mm -hmm. actions. Um, oh man. My damage roll. Oh, so sad. <laughs> okay. Dude, I'm going to just, attack just, just, so just good. the regular stinger part, which is the front of a snake. Yeah, the, you know, the, the teeth. teeth part. Yeah, the <laughs> part. 
Ooh. All right, you smack it upside the head for 14 bludgeoning. Okay, I'll do another one. And then you bust it upside the head for another 10. Okay, and nice. then I'm going to add a smite. Okay. I haven't done that in a minute. You smite out a smite? Too much I'm D&D. Smite. I mean, it's D&D. It could have had a stinger. It, it's a thing. It could. True. Anything could, could happen in D&D. True. <laughs> Maybe Lyra, the legendary ranger, Maybe she's has encountered seen one. snakes with stingers. Has fought one. That's and I'm gonna do a you blinding the question that she has? Ooh, blinding, good one. Yeah. Good idea. I'm gonna do a blinding right, one. Blinding smite. Get... The next time you hit a creature with a melee weapon attack, during this first duration, your weapon flares with a bright light. Um, deals an extra 3d8 radiant damage. Um, in addition, okay. it must make a saving throw. Not a bad additional bonus damage. Kind of bad. I mean, and it's about it like needs yours. to make a um, saving throw, and it's a con save. Um, yep. Snakey boy, what do you have on con? That's one, okay. And what is your DC? Uh, you're going to ask that 15. 15? Mm-hmm. Oh, it's the no cigar. Ooh, um, so scared it for a is second. officially blinded, so it is yeah. under the 5 nice. blinding condition. Okay. Mark that spell that I use. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay. That's why. That's Which basically means it fails any ability checks that re- require sight. Um, you get advantage to hit it, and it gets advantage disadvantage to hit you um, for up to one minute, as long as you maintain your concentration on it. Nice. So, um. It's now the snake's attack. Um, it's just going to use its senses and lunge directly out of the hole in a straight line, which probably means Lasticus. Oh, oh shit. Yikes. Um, because, I mean, let's be real. It isn't exactly going to try to take any deviations and stuff. Um, sure. But don't worry. It's at disadvantage. Um, so we're going to roll it twice. Here's the first one. Would that hit? Uh, that would, actually. Then we'll oh, roll no. the second one. Oh, that doesn't work on that one. Whew. That would miss. Then it missed. Lucky, 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 lucky. Nice. Wow. I mean, I had a spell to make it miss, but it's I'm glad I don't have to They do indeed, but for all intensive purposes, um, the blinding spell, the blinding effect apply is it doesn't get any it doesn't say that it uh can avoid oh, such a, such an effect so it does apply um okay Tiffany. he's got that uh that predator vision yep. you know mm-hmm. yep except yep. it's knocked out <laughs> all right uh we're all wearing the i can kind of see it like um Yeah, okay, it I'm, I'm going to... against the wall as hard as it possibly can and crushes Lyra Mouse. With its stinger. <laughs> um, yeah, all right. <laughs> you know what's coming. Leave it forever, Jane, I'm so sorry. Toll of the dead, baby! Toll of oh. the dead. Oh. Yeah. Uh, oh, and guess, big one. guess what? Snakes don't have any wisdom. <laughs> I didn't think they did. They're not. If it was an owl, we'd be in trouble. Snakes, not so oh, much. Man. They have lots of cunning, lots of agility. Oh my god, if Alice had glasses on, I would never... Um, (laughs) Definitely failed. Uh, 29 points of necrotic damage to the snake. Yeah, baby. Boy! Boy! Get that little slipper snake. Mm-hmm. I might bap it up. Okay, nice shot. Um, Lasticus. After it just attempted to bite you. I really need to save my spell slot, so I'm just going to firebolt it again. Okay. But considering it almost killed me, uh, you I am 60. moving out of the way. Good idea. <laughs> nice choice. Oh. All right, so use your fireball and then use your movement to avoid the hole. Makes sense. Yep. Um, Lyra, the legendary ranger, what would you like to do? Um, I'm still attacking it with my longsword. Uh, don't forget you have an advantage, so you hit Ooh, that's and do two. One attack. And, and you then... hit again and do seven, so seven. A total of nine. Nice. I have advantage, though, so that could be one attack, right? Yeah, but the 
both would have hit. You already hit. I don't need to roll. I you just don't want to roll a two. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't blame I you. Mean, it's fine. That Alrighty. Um, <laughs> yeah. How do you want to deal with the blind snake? I want to kill it. Okay. That. Good. That's good. Cure, why don't you cure its blindness? Nah. Show it the love. Kill it with <laughs> kindness. Well, if um, you can convert tea or may I might. Should I add advantage on there just so that's... Uh, uh, you have advantage on any attack roll. Yep. Okay. That's one. Oh, thank God. Uh, yep, <laughs> that hits because of advantage. Just two. And you that hits. Uh, so 23 total. Nice. Yeah. Okay, uh, it is looking definitely bloodied and beat up. Um. Alrighty, Snakey's turn. Um, let's see. I don't think it gets. Okay, yes, it does. It gets a Constitution save each turn. So, start of its turn, it gets a fail. So, still blind. Nice. Still blind. Um, in that case. Um, let's think. Okay, it's going to turn its head around, because snakes can do that, and shh, just bite backwards, because um, it knows something's back there. And... Let me roll this. Uh, is there an option to roll? No, there's not. Okay, I'm going to roll it twice, and we take the lowest results, because I'm too lazy to do the macro. A 12! It misses! Alrighty, um, Fiffany. You know it. You <laughs> love it. Toll of the dead, baby. Toll of the dead can trips. Alrighty. I'd mix it up if I had a firebolt, but I don't think I could even cast that. And it fails, so it's taking 19 points of necrotic damage. Damn, I'm doing hell of damage. It works so well. It does. It does. It's okay. Such a cool oh nope. That's. It's a blind snake, and we're not getting hit with anything. There's, there's nothing else for me to do. Right. <laughs> like, um, Lasticus. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna <laughs> run, run back to... over and go. Kyaw! Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um... <laughs> Snakes with stingers. I love it. Pew! Uh, Ooh, four, good one. Nineteen. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good one. Oh my god, uh, that's so funny. One. 199 hit points down, one, one hit point left. Um, Lyra! Oh, of course she's gonna Lyra, be there. Lyra, the legendary yeah! Lyra! Snakes, snakes with stingers! stingers. <laughs> you, you can slay the snake at this point. All right! Sure. Now that's a good, that's a good name for a stinger. podcast. Snakes with stingers, you know? Snakes mm-hmm. with stingers, yeah, it's my next, mm-hmm. no, it's my rock band. First attack with advantage. <laughs> yeah! You oh, wow. killed it. Well done, <laughs> Lyra. I cut off the stinger. <laughs> and it dies. That's where Die. snake's venom is held and it's <laughs> Well done, <Yay>. Lara. <laughs> and I put the stinger in my pocket. <laughs> and no one can tell and her. No that. one no one no one no one will ever know that there wasn't one. <laughs> Just okay. Tail you have you have <laughs> slain the snake, the snake that was hiding <laughs> the tree. Woo! All right. Oh, there ain't okay. nothing. There ain't nothing that can stop us now. This is amazing. I love killing all these little nothing demon creatures. Can stop, <laughs> stop us now, yeah. Just saying. I mean, big, small, <sighs> short, tall, doesn't matter. Pillars right. light cleanses it all. All right. <laughs> well done, guys. Write that one down. That one's good. Let's that was a good one. one. That was a good one, right? Yeah, we're gonna Pilar keep that one. didn't kill that. We did. Just so you know. Yeah. That's we okay. Okay. Because I got the killing blow. Right, right, right. right. Okay. I, I mean, also considering that these are just animals, you, you know, they're not oh. like monstrous by other Short means. Um, and well, everybody knows that the snake is the devil's best friend, just like dogs. Amen. Amen to that. Pelor will. One less it. snake, one less spider. On well, her well wait, but that's only with the snakes that have stingers. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ants ruin picnics. 
<laughs> when Holmes, I mean, these are basically demons of the world. This, these are all, this is all the devil's right hands. All and Pilor is happy to have us dispatch it's, it's, a few. It's a demon's fingers on their right hand. You're all right busy hand. discussing mm -hmm. it, and, and Lyra has just sneaked <laughs> off ahead of you. All like, these animals like, uh, came uh, from the demon's hand. Oh, well, uh, Lyra, all Lyra, hold on terrible now. demon animals. Wait, you hold weren't on, listening. You weren't listening. We're telling you where they came from. Yeah. I, know, uh, I know who they came from. Oh. The, the world. Yes. Right. The world of demons. Yeah. And demons. The, just the natural world. No, just the regular world well, in that we the live world, in. There's a balance of demons and good. Correct. Anyway, correct. The world today takes where those everything. Are. <laughs> all of the snakes with all the stingers sure do hurt a lot. <laughs> I just love the idea of like the snake being at the bar and cheers, just like, yeah, give me a pint, you know? <laughs> Where everybody knows your name. <laughs> <laughs> well, you wish you had a stinger. <laughs> okay, yes. Once again, um, all quiet on the Western Front. Ooh, good. What else may lay in wait? I'm gonna look for fake walls as we go now. Watching out in case any other wall turns fake out to walls. be some reptilian head. Snake head. <laughs> this one's not a snake. This it's one's just not there a snake. smiling like. Soon you'll be on a plane. <laughs> with his mouth open, just like. <laughs> yeah, like... I'm ready to eat you. This is a cave with two very large stalact uh, stalactites. <laughs> Lots of stalactites. I had to, had to retweet Jane's tweet immediately. I know, right? <laughs> Once now we're done, uh, I'm going to retweet it. That's what's going to make me famous right there. <laughs> it is. <laughs> I just love the fact that it's so... If you didn't watch this show, you'll never know what that was about. <laughs> You're like, ah. Oh, <laughs> so beautiful. I don't know what, what a snake looks like. Lyra still have a song? She does. She has You're Welcome. No, I sure do. I should get a new song. Should do a new song. You do. Oh, we do. I want snakes with stingers. <laughs> Just a lyra song. Oh, of course. Are we out on time? <laughs> How Ooh. fun! I think this is going to have to be a moment. You'll still sing it as lyra. Okay. <laughs> oh. Everyone will sing it as lyra. I needed to have moved him. <laughs> who? <laughs> yeah, I heard him say hmm, him. Move who? He's cooking something up over there. He's always cooking something up. Look at up. his little face. Look at him cooking. He's always cooking up over there. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out what Lyra can see. Or nothing. Oh, there's blood or something on the ground. Uh, yes, there is a lot of blood stains splattered on the ground. Thick, yeah. gooey flesh. Hold my hand up. Fresh ah. blood. I think we found the nest. Of, of what? Right. Of something the, the you can't prepare anything you need to prepare right now. Uh, okay, a okay. voice in the dark says, You can repair anything you want. It's not going to do you any good. Oh. Hello! So, you've managed to sneak past all my enslaved minions, have you? Uh, well, we didn't sneak past them. We butchered them like right. the animals they were. Like the demon animals that they are. Yeah. Oh, demon animals. <laughs> then you have proven yourself worthy to lay yourselves before me and make an offering. Might we ask who we're speaking with? Who? Surely you know of my greatness. That's what brought you here. Never heard of you. I mean, but we don't even know who it is. <laughs> 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 Never heard. <laughs> I mean. Yes, Sass, there is. <laughs> you, you, um, you stole a bell from a cat. I stole nothing. I you... took it as a trophy. Why? I was victorious. I am the first and only one of my kind to brave such a ginormous beast and get away with a prize so glorious. As the but bell. The, but the cat's not dead. You don't always have to kill things to defeat them, you know. I mean, no, it's true. Might I outwitted it. Step in to look at you. 
No, not unless you make an offering. You must offer something as homage if you are to stand before my greatness. I got an ant head. I do. <laughs> and a uh, snake stinger. I got the tail. <laughs> my snake doesn't have a stinger. <laughs> In fact, no snakes have stingers. <laughs> what are you talking about, you crazy I woman? I read an article from 1898 <laughs> that says otherwise. <laughs> Um, there's a gigantic <coughs> dagger outside this um this wonderful hole you've, you've I have no read for weapons. But a uh, bell. Yes, it is my trophy. <laughs> but I do like trophies too, so I understand, but this one you does not belong to you. It does after I claimed it. It was one fair and square in victory against the beast. Well, I Should I regale story. you of the tale of how I outwitted it? Sure, sure. but can we see you while you tell us? So we yes, you can, it? if you offer me an offering. Homage. Uh, how about uh, information? Um, I have no need for information. I am all-knowing. I know everything. Like cat bell. What do how, we how, have? About a, do we how about a dog whistle? whistle? It would be worthless unless I claimed it from the dog myself. But don't worry. After I vanquish you, I'll claim something from each of your rotting dead corpses. I, I could give you two very tiny mastiffs? <laughs> what is a mastiff? Oh, I mean, yes. Um, I mean, what kind of mastiffs are they? Well, they're going to be very small, I think. But are they valuable? Um, well, they're rare. Rare Mastiffs? Oh, yes, those kind. Got you. I'm, well, I mean, their size makes them unique and rare. That's what I'm getting at. Hmm. Yes. They're, they're collectibles. Give them to me. I will accept your <laughs> Mastiffs as your offering. Wow. I'm, I'm now, like, legitimately scared. If I pull this pocket patch and create two Mastiffs, will they be small or will they just be Oh, gigantic? my God. What? No. How do you, have you ever do, Have you ever been turned into a mouse before and pulled things and pulled a pocket patch? <laughs> no. Oh, boy. But I have, I have arcane knowledge, so I should maybe get a sense? I'll you know? let you have a roll. <laughs> oh, boy. You're oh going to kill us. If you smash me again... All right, 25. Ooh, that's well, a good like an assumption. Like, this is a magical item that I procured okay, as a so human. All of the wizards that you know are very much divided on the subject. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> Every other wizard that you've ever met is convinced that the magic would probably scale because everything else is scaled. Yes. But you, on the other that's hand, don't necessarily believe that. So all the other wizards think one way, you don't think necessarily that way. See, I, I, I do I do, and I don't think that because yes, you're right. I mean, I've been casting spells and they've been scaled, but this is a magical item that's not coming from me. It's just now the size. But maybe what the you size do know same. is yeah. that um, Fennifer and Lyra for sure have magical items and they scaled. So well, your gut tells you it probably will scale. I really don't want to give this thing to living things. <laughs> like that would offer it. I, I, I was really just thinking. I mean, you know. I mean, there's other things I could procure from this. Where are my I mastiffs? Mean, give me my mastiffs. You could just well, get back. I think he even knows what a mastiff. He seems to know what a mastiff is, and I, I have, I, I mean, I have, I, I can create four more, I can create four total, but that, it's a living <laughs> creature, and if this thing is evil, or yeah. once. Okay, but he asked what kind of mastiff, and like, there's only the one kind, so maybe he doesn't know what they are, and you can just give him anything. <laughs> just two of anything, just try it. Well, we will be with you. It's a good one. So out loud, I'm going to say, considering you want to kill us, I don't want you to kill the Mastiffs. I don't want to Ma kill you. 
I want you, you just to said come you... in here and worship me and pay me homage. Okay. And then if you're um... lucky, I'll enslave you like everybody else and you can just do things for me. Or, or... None of us do enslavement. I'm sorry. <laughs> we don't do we don't enslavement. Do enslavement. <laughs> <laughs> it's not our thing. I don't think anyone willingly does that. Well, it's not a willing thing. You will become powerless. I think you're being very um, cowardly by not showing your face while we talk. Why would I need to do that? So you can see the party that's going to take the bell from you. Oh, is that why you're here? You think you're going to take the bell? Well, yes. in that case, don't worry about the homage. Why don't you just come in here and take the bell from me? Yes. You do smell delicious. <laughs> I mean, we're mice. So. Mice? Oh, it's been a long time since I've had a field mouse. Owl. Guys, what? We, we, is this an owl? Because remember how we said we don't want to fight an owl? And it might be one. I don't think owls live underground, do they? I mean, I'm no expert. <laughs> Hey, why ask, ask, ask Lyra. Actually, all the owls. Why don't we ask the Why don't we ask the expert? She knew that snakes Please had stingers. I never she's knew gonna that. She's going to Google it right now, but she's going to find that there are burrowing owls, and it's fine to say that there are actually burrowing owls <laughs> that live underground. Yeah, they do. Well, I didn't realize they would hide this underground. You know, I thought no. they'd just be in like a few feet, maybe just a little den. But God, yeah. we are so stupid when it comes to nature. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> How can we all as people humans know so little? I think we just take this guy out. That's what I'm saying. As much as, much as I ridiculed her for the uh, um, for the snake stinger thing, I'm not going to ridicule her for the burrowing owls because they do exist. They do, and I would never say something that I didn't know. <laughs> they really do About exist. animals, especially. Oh, see, Pepper Jack. Um, Pepper Jack I, I just, a lot just of confirmed it. As a kid. There are burrowing animals owls. Are I know there are, man. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, fine, there are burrowing owls, but they wouldn't burrow. But I, mean, I just find that hard to believe that they well, burrow the, so deep. The magic owl. Yeah. And Bell think, owls. Well, why don't we? We will step into your den and mm -hmm. you can take a good look at us. You step into my den, and as you've already told me, you've come here to steal my bell. I'll kill you. I think there might be some sort of a, a negotiation or a deal here or something. Maybe you, we could just negotiate. For you don't need that bell no more. What do you need that bell for? It's just a bell. It's proof. Of what? That I took it. Well, we could tell everyone far and wide that you took it. Yes, but... It's yes, we... Amongst my kind, I will be revered. And and what is your kind, sir? You know what very well. You? Well, you say you're a god, or you want to be worshipped like I a god. I never said I was a god, although that does have a nice ring to it. Um, Gore, I'm going to start walking into the den very slowly. Okay. Saying, all right, well, if we need to give the Mastiffs, then we all need to, we need to come in here. You said to come in and give them to you, right? I We're said still... you pay homage before you come in, but it doesn't matter now. As I've said, you have declared your intentions, and I have declared mine. If you step in here, I will kill you. So you don't want the Mastiffs then? I will take them from your dead bodies. Well, do you know where they are? Because without us telling you, then you're yeah. not going to get them. I, I have them hidden, so uh, right. you won't find them. You don't, right, I mean, you don't see them here, so that's why we want to come in so we can have the exchange. Mm -hmm. Well, yes. Then, go ahead. Who is bravest? Who is going to step in first? I will bite your head off in one gulp. But then you won't get so you don't so you don't want the mastiffs then? I'm just trying to understand what you might I will take is. whatever you have as trophies after but I've we, killed you. Well we squirreled them away somewhere. You'll never get them. And you want to be talking about revere between your between I don't your, need your mastiffs. Kind? I'll take other things. 
Well, we're just little field mice. If you come on and bop us on the head, you're not going to get much of anything. No, I won't bop you on the head. I will bite your head off. Um. I am going to... Okay, this might be fun. <laughs> So, so the reason we can't see this guy is because he's shrouded in darkness, correct? Um, yeah, I mean, he's not in the lit up area. Okay. Um, I'm going to um, kind of, I'm like, all right, just hold on. I'm going to take a step behind Lear here. And I am going to, let's see, where is it? I am going to use um, divine intervention. Oh, okay. Oh. Just, just because it might be fun. And I'm gonna say, oh. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna kind of go behind Lyra and go, "Oh dear, mighty P Lord, please expose this, expose this nice sayer for who he really is. We cannot see him shrouded in shadows. And please, if you could just light our way, so we know how to move forward, P Lord, we'd be forever grateful. P Lord, praise him. So I'm basically wanting, okay. asking to, to illuminate you the whole area. To roll eleven or lower. Yeah, Jesus. I know, but it's a shot. It's a shot. <sighs> It's a shot. Uh, yep. okay. I mean, you're basically talking directly to Pelor and saying, right. do me a favor, pal. Yeah, so that's, I thought, I thought it'd be fun to at least give it a shot. Nope. Oh, oh no. Pelor. Okay. Um, you, get the dis you get the discerned feeling that Pelor was like, Pfft. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, right. I've got better things to do than illuminate a dirty hole. All right. Okay. He's just, he's just, he's just testing us. He's just testing us. That's all. Okay. He's, he's, dealing with it's just, he's just, he's, no, he knows we're strong enough to do this. He's just testing us. He's just testing he us. He knows we got this. You are boring me. <clears throat> Come inside. Let us do battle. One more attempt before we do battle. I just want you to know that when we are to mice in our human form, we are quite renowned throughout all of the land. And we have someone with us who's very good at spreading stories and telling of someone's greatness. We could do you the honor of talking about the great Leverett all around our- Ah, so you do know who I am! <laughs> yes, I might You told have. lies, you said you didn't know, but you do know, don't you? Uh, Lyra, throw in one of your, um, one of the torches. Like, light a torch and throw it in. Maybe it'll illuminate a little bit more. Oh, fine. I already have a lit torch. I'm just gonna hurl it down. Okay, like, throw Last it into the middle. for it. We should all run in and scatter together. You know? I still don't see anything. Can we tell which direction the voice is coming from within uh, it's this? Kind, uh, I will say, give me a perception roll. Uh, it's kind of a circular chamber, so it's very echoey. Um, a successful perception roll, say DC 15, <laughs> will allow you to discern yeah. the direction. Okay, most of you are unsure. Fiffany, on it. the other hand, seems hey, to Lord. think that it is coming from the right. Hey, well, he's around to the right hand side. Should we just go in there? Well, well, I can, I so think I maybe. Go. How about I try to smoke it out? Um, maybe I'll scare it at the very least. Unless, maybe I'll hit it. What do you think? All right, do it, do it, do uh, it. Back up. Yeah. Back all right, I'll stay in front though. So I'm going to cast. I mean, so only using the vision I have, right? Uh huh. I'm gonna, I'm gonna cast a fireball at fifth level. Okay. So. Ooh. Oh jeez. Uh, so it's a third level spell, so it becomes ten d six instead of eight d six, okay. right? Because I'm adding two more. Um, and you're casting it. Where? I'm casting it like here. Because okay. that's like the edge of my vision. The rest is kind of darkness. Hi. So there it is. <laughs> I know it's fireball glory. Okay, dokie. That's a good roll. Um, from there, it's a twin. It's a twenty-foot radius. Yes, in all directions. Yeah. I'm, I'm more worried about us. <laughs> right? Okay, good. We're yeah. just a. <laughs> okay. 
So basically, almost the entire chamber will engulf in a huge blast of flames. Um, so basically, that's going to go off. Alrighty, um, DC 17 check. And he can try to have it. Which he will. Oh. <laughs> okay. Um, All right. So you go. And you hear this. Damn you. Now you have made me angry. Um, and like you, you hear like a. <laughs> and landing in front. Ah. Um, <laughs> is this rabbit a huge big white rabbit with glowing red eyes and nasty pointy teeth of course Gore um, <laughs> of course. So and that's a great place for us to finish <laughs> the show <laughs> oh my god it's not ordinary rabbit <laughs> oh, and now the eyes, now your balls. voice for it makes more sense. Yes. Uh, yeah, and <laughs> Leverett is another name for a rabbit, if you didn't know. That's, um, that makes sense, too. So there you go. Alrighty, so yeah, that's where we're going to wrap it up for this evening. Hey everyone, Shagget here. Thank you for watching our 10th campaign on how we roll set in Aconis. Uh That means I've done 10 of these outros, and while I usually try to be creative or unique or funny... I figured with the 10th one, I should just shoot straight, uh, especially considering this campaign is gearing up to be the funniest we've done. At least, I hope so. <laughs> I mean, how, how, how would I know? Um, you can follow me on Twitter at Ineb underscore combos or on Twitch at twitch.tv slash shagget. Um, take solace in the fact that I didn't read off of a script this time. Oh, and no. And that shows how bad this really is. But thanks. See you guys. Hi, I'm Jane, and I play Hello, Lyra Grant. Hello, it's me, it's me, Lyra, the legendary ranger at your <coughs> service. You know me already, but what you didn't know is I've been playing Jane on How We Roll for the past eight years now. I've done it. I've spoken my truth. I've let the cat out of the bag, all right? It's just me with a baseball cap on. That's it. So if you'd like to follow my character Jane on Twitter, you may do so at Jane on Twitch with a zero, not an O. And you're probably wondering, Lyra, what's that beautiful crown that adorns your head? Well, when people start calling you queen, you must look the part. So dragons need slaying, people need saving, uh, yada yada yada, I have to go, so busy. All right, toodaloo, goodbye. Oh, um, and peace, suckers. Our next and final contestant here at the Outro Olympics, Matt Petullo from How We Roll. He is bursting with potential, teeming with talent, but just can't get his technical game tightened up enough to bring home the gold. He's been working hard in the off season. Let's see if he can put something together here magical, bring home the gold. Streamer ready. Hi, the Snuggler, Instagram, that real Matt underscore, Twitter, Maddie Sweet Tweet. Thank you for watching. Yes, yes, he has done it. Ladies and gentlemen, he has done it. What How a great day for how we roll. What a great day for humankind. What do you know? All 20s. Oh, sorry. I didn't see you there. It is I, Christy. Uh, you may know me from such campaign as the last one. Anyway, now that I'm a seasoned D&D player and streamer, I'm sure you're going to be wanting more of my excellent content. You can find me in that, but mostly me, on our D&D podcast, New Crits on the Block. And if you just can't get enough of my perfect eye for wit and whimsy, you can find me on Twitter and Instagram at Chris Tactics. Anyway, I should get back to this delicious glass of 20s. Cheers! Hi there, I'm Gorbad. Welcome to the Orc's Nest. I'm the Dungeon Master here on How We Roll, and if you'd like to follow me personally, you can do so on Twitter, at Gorbad. Check out thedmblog.com for all things Dungeon Master and Dungeons and Dragons related. And of course, you can follow me on twitch.tv slash Gorbad. Also guys, don't forget 
To keep up with all things How We Roll, follow us on Twitter at How We Roll. Check out the website, www.howweroll.com, and make sure you follow us on YouTube as well. Cheers, guys. 